Hello, hello. I am going live tonight. I didn't see anyone live at the moment. Uh, if there is anyone going live right now, right now, I do apologize. I'm primarily just doing this live stream, just primarily to unpackage what's in this uh, package right here from Jadren Aquatics. Uh, this is something I received because I am a supporter of his. I joined his uh, little membership club at on YouTube. So if you're interested, definitely check it, check his channel out, check out his membership levels, and see if it interests you as well. Uh, this is just a little something that he sends out. Uh, of course, if you look at this big blue pig piece of tape, it's primarily because he writes the address in big, big, big letters. And I don't want to share that information out on public. Although, if you do want to mail me uh, via USPS, you can always email me at P.O. Box 168 at Wood, California 92811. But let me go ahead and open this right now. Uh, hello to all who have joined me so far. Um, hello out there. Hope everything's well. But let me go ahead and open this up and see what I received from Jadron Aquatics. I know a portion of it is going to be stickers. Uh, so let's get to see what stickers I've got. I haven't opened this yet. It's been sitting in my house for a few days, primarily so I can get a chance to actually do this. Um, okay, so let's see what I got in here. Ooh, I got a few things. Ooh, the stickers are a little bit messed up. They're a little out of whack. But let me see here. Let me pull out all the stickers here. And of course, it looks like they did kind of get all messed up and jumbled up in there. But that's okay. I'll just be pulling them out anyways. And I do have something else in this package to show you as well. So let me get this situated over here. And of course, right off the bat, I do see my good friend Aqua Balls. I see his right off the bat. <laughs> so I already have one of these, but it's always good to have multiple ones. Uh, but primarily, uh, Jadron does do uh, stickers for the Fish Club. Not fish club for the fish fam uh so if you ever do, if you're doing stickers and you have a sticker design that you want to make up definitely contact him and he can make cool little stickers for you i don't know how much he charges i know uh anthony's fishy clubs did uh just get his done from him Ooh, and guess what speaking of An anthony's fishy friends ooh, cool this is neat i thought i was gonna have to wait until another day to get his but looky, 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 looky what I got. I got Anthony's Fishy Friends. And this was in the package from Jadron's Aquatics. <laughs> yes, George, that's you. And this is uh, Anthony's. Uh, anyways, uh, hi, hello to Zero G Aquatics, a.k.a. George, a.k.a. Aquaballs. Hey, Ian, how's it going? So this is two right off the bat I got. Uh, like I said, basically, this is a whole pamphlet of stickers that I do get. I'm going to go over these for, in a few seconds. But I do want to show you what I received as well along with this. And this is going to be, ooh, awesome. This is completely awesome. I got two prints right here from a good friend of the fish fam that uh, is associated with General Aquatics. So what this is is some art prints from Miss Priscilla. So there's Angelfish, which is a lovely, lovely picture. She does really good jobs at drawing. Uh, this is one of them. Hey, Meridol, how's it going? And I, I'm sorry if I'm mispronouncing that name. I know I could pronounce the last name Singh, but I'm not sure about the first name. I'm guessing Meridol, or please correct me if I'm wrong. And this print right here, which is a lovely, lovely print. Got a few discus in there, got a zebra pleco, and as well as another angel and a planted tank with rocks. So these I'm definitely going to have to find a spot to hang. Probably purchase a frame and frame them up somewhere and add them to my collection of art that I'm going to be hanging around my aquarium. Uh, so I got those two prints right there. So let's go ahead and go through what stickers I did receive. Um, of course, you already seen Aqua Balls. you already seen Anthony's Fishy Friends. So I'm really glad I got this one. I'm surprised that it's in here. So I wasn't really expecting this one because I know Anthony just got his done recently. But apparently he had the, he had the logo already when he sent this out. So that is wonderful. So I'm going to hold on to those. I know those people. 
And here's another person we all know, which is H.C. Aqua, a.k.a. Jesse. Uh, he's here here occasionally. Um, so anyways, that's that. Hello, Nightbot. How's it going today? <laughs> uh, so anyways, I got those. I was always needing another one of these because I do want to put this on the tub outside where I have Jesse's um, rice fish that I got from him. Uh, got Tazawa tanks. I love this logo. I love the fish with the muscles. George, you got stung again? Hey, Bob Kaler, how's it going? By the way, Bob Kaler, thanks so very much for donating the other night. I do appreciate it. Um, also, I do, I, gotta I do gotta show you something, Bob Kaler, because I guess I, I visited uh, Teespring uh, at, at one point. I think I might have been checking out your uh, teas, Bob, but now Facebook is promoting Teesprings, and on my list is, your shirt is number one on that list. Okay, got MTA. Um, I'm guessing this might be multi-tank addiction, if I'm not mis mistaken. Please correct me out there if I'm wrong, but that's a nice little sticker, nice little picture of a fish. I always love getting stickers of fish. Uh, George, you need to take care of that uh, spider problem that you have at your house. Okay, so let's see here. So I'm going to separate this in piles of tan uh, people I do definitely watch and people I kind of can watch occasionally and ones I need to check out more. Uh, hey, Rockford, how's it going? I'm just going over some stickers I got from Jadron, Jadron's Aquatics. I did sign up for his membership, and what he does is he sends out stickers. So I'm just going through which ones I need to check out and which ones I have. Uh, so you got Danny's Aquariums. There's a lot of stickers on there I've never checked out. This is a nice way to actually promote channels. Uh, hopefully they still do videos. <laughs> uh, yeah, George got bit by another spider. Um, and then I got this one, which I have no clue who this is. Uh, AA. I see fish gals in the, in the circle, but I don't know what that AA stands for. Uh, like I said, if anyone knows in the in the live chat, please let me know whose channel these are that I don't know. Or if you're watching the replay, please put it in the comment below. Uh, I'm going to put that in the I don't know pile. I know this guy, which is Blake's Aquatics. I got a sticker from him now. Let's see, I'm going to put that in the pile of people I watch. Got Guppy Boy. <laughs> AA anti aircraft. <laughs> yeah, I guess that is that that, that stands for uh, anti aircraft or alcoholic anonymous or aquarium anonymous. <laughs> Could really mean anything. So I'm going through my list of piles. Okay, this one I'm gonna have to really, really, really uh, fish. Oh, okay, this is just hash, hashtag fish fam international. Hey, Griff, how's it going? Hope everything's well. Uh, so I'm going to put that in the pile of, I don't know, because I don't know if that's a, just a hashtag or a channel, because I don't see any channel name on that one. Um, I guess if anyone wants to come up here, I will just go ahead and pop the link up. If you haven't yet, make sure you check out Griffin's Fish Room and subscribe to him if you haven't. Let's at least get him a little bit higher. Let's actually get him to finally up to 500 on his swim to 1,000. And that's the link if anyone wants to jump on here. And, of course, everyone knows this one, which is Ohio Fish Rescue. Um, and, of course, there's a lot of stickers here. Let's see here. Okay, got... Uh, okay, this one I can barely read. Crystal Rose. Okay, I think this is uh, the Crystal Rose Pets, which if I could barely make that out, but I think that's Crystal Rose. I'm guessing that says Pets inside the paw print. We put that in the to checklist. Hey, Scott's Aquatics, how's it going? Hey, dude, how's it going? Hey, what's up? Not much. Still, still playing that game. Yeah. <laughs> 
Ooh, this this is a name I haven't heard in a while. Jeff Rose Fishkeeping. And this one actually has the uh, link to his channel as well, which is awesome. Uh, neat little trick on the YouTube uh, URL. You actually don't need that slash C slash, but it's still nice that's actually on the sticker. It's up. It looks like George is having internet problems. Hey, I got snacks. How's it going? Griff left a case of Mountain Dew in the trunk bed. <laughs> hey, Bob Taylor got free Mountain Dew. <laughs> Mountain Dew in the trunk bed? You forgot about that? That's Mountain Dew abuse. That's a felony hey, in some states. Look what I got, Priscilla. <laughs> I got your artwork now. That's pretty. Print. This is from uh, the package I received from General Aquatics for being a member on his membership side. And I'm just going over the stickers I got, like Michael's Fish Room. I couldn't, okay. Priscilla, I couldn't see you all hanging. Priscilla goes, oh, wow, yeah, someone just... decided to come on. Yeah. <laughs> I wasn't sure if Derek was going to stream tonight or not, but I kind of, I kind of did want to go over this package, and I really didn't want to make a video for it, although I would have if I had to. <laughs> Sometimes I just like going live and doing this kind of stuff just because it just takes time to actually videograph it and uh, do this and that. Hey, Priscilla, how's it going? There we go. I got something <laughs> in the mail, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> you got you got a coffee mug. Yep, she got my coffee mug. I'm Is that your adult mug. coffee mug or just your coffee mug? It's my, my new coffee mug. It's nice and your big, new. too. Yep. But, yeah, see that? Yeah, super mill people. They changed the package in my box because it wouldn't fit in the box. And they <laughs> punctured a hole from the hinge. Yeah. And took some pain off. Well, I, I sent out a uh, issue report on that, so hopefully they'll reprint it for you. Did you send them the pictures? Uh, I, I I got the pictures. Uh, they didn't really ask for the pictures yet, but I'm I'm assuming that they will. And look, I did something else today. Ooh, more tanks. <laughs> yeah. Really filling out the fish room more. Yeah, I'm, I'm already out of tank space. Is this Susie Q's? Yes. Ah, okay. The old one. Yeah. I think the I think the Q gave that one away with the silhouette of the angelfish there. And Priscilla, these are eight by tens, right? Uh, it's, no, eight and a half by eleven. Uh, eight and a half by eleven. Okay. So I'm gonna have to find a frame for them and frame them somewhere. I'm going to have to make a folder for Chase and with my prints with signature on it. Uh, because he's sending all these prints without signature. Yeah. yeah. I've had a couple of people message me, can I send the print to you so you can sign it? <laughs> and I'm like, that's kind of pointless because I can just send you the print signed. Yeah. Well, if you're ever in town, I'll probably just bring them with me and I'll have you sign them in person. Hey, Anthony, how's it going? Because I usually get them to me not signed, so I can cut them and sign them. Look what I got, Anthony. Priscilla, I had a vision when I was down in the fish room uh, a couple hours ago. Has it something to do with aliens? No. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start uh, slowly. I'm going to start buying all your pictures and do a whole collage wall. A Ooh. collage wall? Yeah, just, you know, one right after another, your pictures. Huh. That's a good idea. That's a nice, nice little. I don't yeah. have that many. <laughs> so let uh, it grow as you get more and more. Yeah. Picasso oh, yeah. has one until he has everything. He's like, what are you waiting for? Get drawn. <laughs> yeah. Get well, drawn. I have a school of fish. <laughs> oh. And I did went just by the way, everybody that gets uh, prints from Punchy or not a little cart. Yeah. Walmart has this four by four frame um 
for 97 cents. Ooh, cool. And it fits in perfectly. You can hang yeah. it up or you can set it down. Hmm. That I got like a baseball card size. And that's from Catfish Terry. Oh, wow. That's Captain Sir. It's blurry. Captain something. Captain Savage Aquatics. Oh, Savage. Oh, he hasn't been around for a while. I haven't seen him in a minute. Yeah, so I'll put that in that list. Yeah, a lot of these, I mean, they, they probably don't do videos anymore, but there's a whole bunch that uh, I guess Gadwin did throughout the years. So is that like the fish tubers equivalent of Pong or Pog or whatever they called it? Apparently. Okay. <laughs> well, I guess, I mean, what Jadron Aquatics does, he does uh, stickers for a lot of people in the fish fam, and I guess he's been doing this for years. Hmm. And Jason's apparently, I mean, he's got a whole collection of people he's done stickers for. Jason's and right now, if you join up with his membership on YouTube, uh, which is, I think, like four ninety nine a month, he basically sends this out to you. Jason um, has been around since, I think, 2016. Yeah. Because that's and, when I started selling my prints. Yeah. And uh, basically, for the month of November, if you're uh, members during the month of November, he also sent you the uh, prints from Priscilla that he prints out. Which, this this print, this is really good quality quality work, too. I mean, it, it, looks, it looks really good. Nice little card, nice really stock to it, and it just looks mag magnificent. Just the artwork that Priscilla does is just excellent as well. His prints are good. Yes, they are. Is this where you uh, print yours uh, through uh, when you uh, sell them? Yes. Honestly, I have to admit, I watch you draw and call uh, and do your pictures, and I hate you for it because <laughs> I cannot. I hey, can Jesse. see it in my head. It just doesn't translate to my hand, and it looks like a fish that got run over by a car that got run over by an airplane. Can you do a stick fish? Yes, you didn't completely missing. I'm, I'm still going through the stickers right now. So, as you can see, I have a lot of them to go through. So, I'll probably get it by the end of the stream. <laughs> you might get Jesse's old school sticker in there. That's what I'm hoping. That's what I'm really, really hoping. I, I remember in our class, they told me, yeah, us to so us and I failed. Priscilla, so. Yesterday, somebody asked me if I could give his daughter's art lessons because she's she's 13. She's really good. She oh, just cool. needs a little bit pointers in the right directions. And I was like, I don't think I can give art lessons because I don't know what the heck I'm doing. I'm just <laughs> doing it. Now, do you, do you know any pointers you could teach? I was like, she can show me her work, and I can give her like her teeth. Yeah. So, if you yeah. don't know how to teach, you have no basis on how you know what to even start teaching. It's not about uh, not knowing how to teach; it's just class. do art. I don't like follow any concepts, any rules, any whatever. I just do what I mm -hmm. do. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's well. I think I think that's where all the good artists come from, anyways. They just where, do what they yeah. do. Pam, she's more of a professional fine artist because she like does oil and she like does color studies and and and. I mean, I did color studies too, but mm. not on that same level. Mm. This is a nice clean logo. I like this nice clean logo right here. I was wondering where he went too. Yeah, <laughs> a lot of defunct channels. I got to take a picture of my angel fish so I can send it. Uh, the, well, it's the one on the screen, but now and send it to Priscilla and I'm going to, I'm going to do something. I got to make her uh, do me a new logo. Uh, only charge $200 an hour. <laughs> hey, that's cool. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Bob. I did see someone else do a uh, unboxing of these as well. And I saw Jesse's old one in there too. So I'm hoping I have the same one. So <laughs> when you hear, when you hear hey, the news that bank, bank got robbed in Rockford, you know what happened. <laughs> <laughs> and of course, hey, this is January hey, Aquatics. Not, so. Wait a minute. Stop that. Because banks get robbed here all the time. <laughs> 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 Next thing you know, the FBI is going to be. <laughs> <laughs> Big Brother is listening. Yeah. Charles Discus. Oh, oh, they probably tricked me anyway. 
they, I got like I got two different phones. One of them's from the state, so I know they're tracking me. They know I'm where I am. Hey, if anybody knows somebody that owns Altum Angels, please tell them to contact me. I need a really good picture of the Altum Angel. Mm -hmm. Um, uh, Jack Watley. Contact them and see if they can get a good picture. Fifty four punchy. That one's cute. I think our daughter did that one for her. Yeah, this this is a nice one. I like this one. Oh, nice and cute. Oh, I just broke my desk. Hold on. Because I want to say all them are in here. Oh, didn't hear what, Bob? The ship is sinking. What, 54 punchy? My ship is? I doubt it because I'm not even in the game. Let's see. And Kripke, the Chameleon and Friends. Never heard of this channel. <laughs> but... There's a lot of channels in here that I haven't heard of. <laughs> like this one, which has a really nice little logo right here. Nice and pretty cool. Red Dirt Cichlids. Another name I haven't heard. Or ran across in my like, travels. Real Altums, Jesse? Or like the, what's it, the other ones? Uh, Deum? Datum? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, but I need the permission for that picture. Yeah, she's gonna need permission. Has to do with copyright issues. You need permission to draw a fish based on a picture. No, you don't. No, you do. Oh, oh, I forgot. Picture the picture is starts. considered art, and that would be their art. The yeah, but it's still. The right thing to do to ask for permission. Yeah, just doing stuff like that. It's just, it, it might be legal, but then again, you just have you're just running into issues in, in the end. You I mean, I can want to avoid any kind of legal things. issues because then even then you still have to pay for lawyers to fight it. I could change a couple things and make it look like not that picture anymore, but still, the fish store that's right two miles down the road from where I work. My competition, they just got in like eight big old Ultima Angels. I'll just go over there and take pictures. <laughs> Keeping it fresh. Why not? Do it. I think I actually went there. How do you know they got them in? Are you stalking huh? them? Uh, I know people that know people that go check for prices and stuff. Yeah. And. They're, they're, for some reason, every time I go over there, all their prices are 49 cents cheaper than ours. Hmm. Who's this, that one? This is Royal Fish Aquarium. Oh, no, wait, sorry. Royal Fish Aquatics. Yeah, hasn't been around in a while either. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so some of these I can really tell. <laughs> that, that, um, you're in there. A lot of these stickers, you can really tell that you, you probably need to do, like, some tips, like make sure make sure you actually read what what's on there. <laughs> Some of these are hard to read. Man, I want my shrimps. Oh, you gotta be a hey. So, when did you have that shipped to you? I got this. Um, I think I got this on Saturday. <laughs> okay, so it wouldn't include mine then. What do you mean? Oh, yeah, dude. It, it. it did include yours, yes. Right when you came up, he showed it on screen. Oh. So he got your I'm sticker surprised this was in it. here. You weren't even... This guy's not even paying attention to your stream. You can't <laughs> believe that. Well, at least he's not playing a game. I'm not playing a game. I'm... I'm, I'm seriously. Let's see. I'm, uh, I'm yes, on. David is one of mine. I have not come across it yet. But as you can see, I still have a bunch to go through. No, I, I completed what I wanted to complete today like three hours ago. <laughs> oh, by the way, uh, Bob, happy belated birthday. Oh, happy birthday, Bob. Bob's birthday. 
Was it? Was it? Uh, it was the day, right? The thirtieth. Bob, do you spell your name backwards? <laughs> Why didn't I get a notification? Happy birthday, Bob. Okay, so Bob says that Royal Fish is a new channel. A new channel? I'm definitely have to go check him out because I haven't heard of him. So another channel. Oh, go check out. yeah, yeah. But that was somebody else. It was Royal Aquatics or something. Yeah, a few maybe. years back. I thought it was like Royal Fish. Then. I remember uh, a an, uh, a logo of an a Royal Pleco. And it was, I, I could have sworn it was Royal Pleco now that it's said. Mm. E. Michael was awesome. Here's a picture of a rummy nose from Full Frontal Fish. Hey, you guys want to see what Debo gave me? No. <laughs> uh, he left his headphones here. Yeah, I left my headphones I hit in his car. <laughs> and I, said I, knew you guys, I, I knew I forgot something. Not you girls. Just like your stickers, I forgot your stickers. Oh, I was just talking to Dave. What? He said or he was you guys, not stickers. you girls. So I was only talking to you. Ah, gotcha. And I also forgot to pick up one of his stickers. I don't know how you keep going. Ooh, this is a nice looking fish. Colorful. Gabe's Aquatics. Add the stores to check out. And oh, by the news. way, all the clean out works. Oh, awesome. Well, I'm going to keep my algae in there now because I got some uh, snails on my way. I picked up some of those, um, those uh, marbled limpets uh, snails from uh, Aqu uh, Aquatic Arts. No, you didn't. What? You did? Yes. Um, I ordered them. How many? Ten. Give me some when they breed, if they breed. If they breed. <laughs> I'm, well, maybe I'll have a look in my uh, my uh, multi sink, maybe, because I do put some cichlid salt in there, and I do have hard water in there, so it might. I will live. Yeah, because uh, basically they, I, I, most, most people said they need brackish, although there's some on, like, kind of, Reported but not confirmed uh, cases of them actually breeding them fresh. I honestly think most everybody bought something off of Aquatic Arts this weekend. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I try to order more snails today, but they were they were charging me thirty one dollars for shipping. Unlike last night, they only charged me nineteen. No, they're doing. Um, they put a, they put out an email. Um, shipping is regardless. Send them an email with all of your order numbers, and they'll combine the shipping all in one. Yeah, I know. They well, did. They're going to charge me the thirty-one dollars instead of the nineteen. Oh, I thought you meant you. No, because I order. I ordered the marble limpet snails last night, and shipping was nineteen dollars. I try to order some more in a different quantity, and they're charging me thirty-one. Oh, might be the bigger box. No, they're they're they're. I ordered a ten pack last night. I tried to order like uh, three. Uh, oh, I guess it could be a bigger box. Hey, Poe, how's it going? Hey, T Bone. I don't know. For me, I, I love them because it's only twenty dollars and seventy five cents for next day air. Yeah, well, you're you're also closer to them too. Yeah, so I'm in California. Uh, well, that's why I, Aquatic Arts is like one of the first places I'll go to when I'm looking because yeah. they're so close. Yeah. My first place is uh, going to be on my channel a few weeks from now when I actually do the fish tour, tour of uh, Aquarium Fish Depot. And that's like 90 minutes to drive. I did uh, Aquatic Adventure uh, about six months ago. Mm. The H Aquatics. Nice little goldfish. And now time for a fish riding a motorcycle from the Freeze Aquariums. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'll put that in the channels I know and I need to check out again. And then we got Otter Creek Aquatics. And this is the sticker before he actually got the camera on the around the neck. 
I know his new logo has uh, the camera around his neck rather than no camera around his neck. Let's see here. Where's Kevin? Yeah, where's Kevin? Speaking of Kevin, <laughs> here's KVN, which is kind of like Kevin. I shipped him some mail today, and he did. He gave me his address, but not his name. So I just wrote fucking fish. <laughs> you should wrote Kevin fucking fish. No, I wrote Kevin Aquatics. I gotcha. You should have wrote son of father fucking fish. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, here's 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 one I know that he does other things, which is this has a picture of a yellow lab. I think that's a yellow lab. Yeah, maybe it's not. I don't know. It looks like a yellow lab to me. Which is Larry D's Tanks and More. Is that a yellow lab right there? I haven't seen him in a while either. Probably. Uh, I, I've seen him here and there. He does uh, some hot hot sauce videos. Ah, uh, that's right. <laughs> Jesse, uh, Jesse shipped it to him as Kevin Aquatics as well. <laughs> the more I see a father fucking fish, the more I realize uh, Kev looks like a uh, father fish. <laughs> I'm starting to think it's an illegitimate child somewhere. Yeah, maybe I should wait for this person to actually come into the chat. I think I will do that. I'm going to save this one for later. See if uh, they actually pop up in the stream. Because this so, person right here comes in the stream often, so I'm going to save that one until I see him or the very yeah. end. Taylor, zero G is back. Uh, so that's. The old aqua balls, right? <laughs> I mean, seriously, the zero G is aqua balls, right? Yep. Okay. okay. I, was, I, was, I, was, I know we were talking about zero G, and then we saw. It. Yeah, it's, uh, his was one of the first ones I pulled out, which was this one right here. This one was actually falling out of the uh, thing when I pulled it up. Ooh. The Pleco Boys. Not a name I'm familiar with, but I need to go check them out. So I'm going to put, put them in the pile to check out. Ones I know I'm not uh, subscribed to at all yet. Let's see. Got Fish Boy, just regular Fish Boy. You know what would be nice? A Fish Tubers phone book. Fish Tubers uh, phone book? Yeah, but not phone book. Uh, a fish tubers YouTube book, I guess. Hmm. Well, I know Fish from Fever runs a website that has the at least a list of streams. Yeah. That are scheduled, anyways. This is an unscheduled stream. Stream here. BJ Pacini. Hey, BJ Palmer, how's it going? Hey, BJ. Zero G. Let's see, T Bone says you got me, George Aquaballs. Why the change of name? Aquatic Express is the next sticker I got in queue right here. Anthony, stop harassing me. Whoa. What? Am I going to have to put him on timeout? He's, he's sending me messages. Ah. <laughs> okay, this is a nice clean logo as well. And just stop replying. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, I got it now, finally. This is a nice clean logo. Well done, Tanks. I like how clean this one is. Mine is better. My artist was better. <laughs> well, clean is not always a plus, but I mean, this this one is just nice and clean. This looks like no, it is. It's clean. Yeah. What is that? The Gobies? That looks like a fish tank logo. Well, you know, a fish tank yep. manufacturer logo. Uh, yeah. Kind of the corner of the that RNH2O, which I haven't seen a video from her in a while. Hey, George is back with Aqua Balls. Um, I do know of a, a person that does uh, South uh, South American and Central American cichlids, I believe. Uh, Ashes cichlids. Ah. 
and uh, she's been gone for a while. I guess she had a kid, and she you didn't even know. Either. She didn't really even know people do streams and stuff for the fish tube. <laughs> yes, they do. She's back now, right? Yeah, she just started posting again. Ah. You know who I miss the most? Who you miss the most? Ray. Yeah. Which Ray? Ray's Aquaria. Ah, gotcha. I don't hey. think I ever watched her because I think she left like before I really started subscribing to a lot of people. Yeah. I've watched a few of hers. She finally graduated and then got a real job. <laughs> a good one. Ah, uh, that's good. I used to watch a channel and they did a lot of steam raids. And and then all of a sudden I just stopped seeing video. I I, I don't get it. I can't remember the channel though. The name. Danakin Aquatics. Oh, he had one made through there too. Yeah. This is a, this is a smaller version. <laughs> this chick stickers are ginormous. Yeah, yeah. No. aren't they awesome? <laughs> yes, they are. Deb Tim, a Canadian girl. Deb Tim. I'll put that on that list. And we got, let me see which way to hold this one up. Mains, tails, furs, and fins. Yeah, some of these I should probably hold hold back, but yeah, I'll put that in that one. Everyone is George tonight? What? Everyone's George tonight. <laughs> yeah, six foot twenty three. I wanna be a George. Uh, I can't be a George. Flynn's fish room. Oh, you froze. Oh, there you back. Ah, everyone froze. Hey, KG, KG, KG Six Woods, how's it going? Kevin. I like that one. Which one? The, the one that you just put uh, the guppy? Yeah. This one? Flynn? Flynn's fish form? That's it, a, I like it, yeah. Flynn is triple F. <laughs> FFF. But oh, the father of fucking fish. <laughs> Do we really want to get into F's cube again? <laughs> well, we're not going that far into math, so. Okay. Hey, Big J, how's it going? Fun's a good kid. Hey, Big J. Got SLC Aquatics, hashtag Fish Fan Mom. Got hers. Well, actually, never mind. Fling grew up. Because when I met him, he was like... 14 and now he's like what 19 or something well wow. he's he's a big boy now can't call him kid anymore he grew like three feet in <laughs> that time um if they're younger than you they you can call him a kid a terrible can, girl can uh, to call anthony a kid yes, i call my best friend from high school a kid you're all Don't kids call me no kid you're all kids <laughs> Uh, how old are you? <laughs> to an eighty-year-old, we're all kids. You don't want to call me kid, P. I'll call you mom. Cooper. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I call Susan mom. I well, call Susan mom. mom. Let's see North Aquatics. Guppy with a maple oh, leaf on it. Awesome. Oh, that's pretty cool. It kind of blends in there, too. Hmm. Put that in that pile. Meta. Meta fish. That fish is really meta. That's pretty cool. I like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you know how many you were sent? How many different ones? <laughs> a whole stack of them. I'm, st I'm still going through them. <laughs> Damn. I've only got about not even halfway through, and what what this is, and it's been I've been going for like 40, 40 minutes so far. 
Kevin? No. Don't even try. <laughs> I'm 56. I could call you all kids. Oh wait, hold on. Let me let me let me re 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 say that. I'm 57. I could call all you kids. Yep, exactly. <laughs> okay, Grandpa. <laughs> Let's see, Rymaxiclids. I'm guessing that's Rymaxiclids. See what cichlids are those? Then that pile. I saw an OB and something else. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, I'll put that up. What cichlids are this? That looks like a. Oh, that's not an OB. I thought it was an OB. It's blurry in the back. Yeah. Is that a cichlid in the back? It's blurry. Yeah, those are it? cichlids. Uh, is that those common? Are big ones. The uh, front one is a peacock, definitely. The back one, I can't tell. It's blurry. Uh, let me see here. Yeah, it's kind of hard to see with all the sparkles. Could be a... Uh, let's see. <laughs> hey, Chevy Fish lives in Illinois. <laughs> no, 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 Fishy Mon. I, I'm, I'm still a kid. I'm a kid to you still. Chevy Fish knows our pain then. She knows what? Uh, knows our pain. If she's in Illinois, she knows our pain. <laughs> what pain? We all feel it. What, living in Illinois? Yep. Sergeant Tank. Pain? Sergeant Tank. If the country had an armpit, Illinois would be it. <laughs> Does it stink? <laughs> okay. um, Onward. I'm sure some places do. Oh, okay, this is a small stack. I guess some of this is this is a pile where some of them fell out already. Let's see, jar of fish room. Never heard of that one. Put that in that pile. I got really crappy envelopes. I ordered some off Amazon, but I had to go to my favorite store, Walmart, yeah. and buy some. And they uh, don't make good ones. Ah, uh, who does make good ones? Amazon. Ah, uh, gotcha. Amazon Basics. Aft. AFT. Anyone that's know what AFT stands for? Nice. Now that is basic. Very that's simple. Anthony's Fish... Uh, not Anthony's. Angelo's Fish Tanks. Ah, okay. Gotcha. He's Canadian. <laughs> He's Canadian? Well, how do you know it's not Aphrodite's Fish Tanks? No, it's Angelo's Fish Tanks. Okay. Is, is Scott still here? He used to make a lot of videos, freshwater videos, and then he converted to saltwater and get and now it's just now he's a saltwater snob. <laughs> oh, a snob? Yeah. One of those people. Oh yeah. Uh, well, no need to subscribe, that is thing, Anthony, seriously. When when the, when a person that's freshwater, they go into saltwater and get rid of freshwater. They start like back in the day. They'd stop talking to all their freshwater people. They'd start talking to only saltwater people. They be, actually became a saltwater snob. No, I'm just kidding. He's the best. He's the nicest person on this planet. Got still the call call him. Real? Okay, I'll subscribe then. This is yours, right, Scott? Or do we have another Scott's Aquatics on YouTube? <laughs> Let me invite him to here. Well, can't you see his logo? Scott, why far do I not have one of those? <laughs> well, Anthony, all you have to do is you gotta become a member to Genuine Aquatics. So they'll send you this whole bunch. Nah, it's only five bucks for all these stickers. Nah, nah. Logan's fish room. Angelo. Is hey, Anthony hey. watching Holy Grail again? <laughs> See, it's been a really great value for being his member lately. So I also got these too. Yeah, I like that. That's cool. <laughs> got one, that one, That's and that one. Although they're just not, they're just not autographed by uh, Priscilla, though. Yeah, yeah, me too. 
I need to send, he just using the prints I sent him to print for me. He needs to use the ones that have a signature on them. <laughs> Sometimes Jason is a space cadet and he probably didn't even notice it. Yeah. Yeah, gotta remove the tape on this one now. Never, never ever put your Mountain Dew down. Always have it. <laughs> Cradle. Hey, Dave, now you can sign it and say it's yours. What's this mountain? What was that? Type? So now you can sign it and say it's your art. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. I'd want to give uh, Priscilla the uh, credit. Can you forge my signature? No. Maybe I should make a contest. Who's the best one that can forge my signature? Ooh, there you go. See, you just got to come back. And next time come you back. come back, you got to sign it for him. As if he's going to forge his anyway. Oh, this is awesome. A signing uh, tour. <laughs> she goes around to the pet shops and signs her art. Hey, you just grab it. No, that's not going to happen. I don't have time for that. Yeah. You don't love us anymore. I'll, I'll, I'll meet you at Aquashella. Yeah. This is another pretty clean uh, logo. There's one in Chicago, by the way. Wait, Aquatic. Uh, I'm not going into Chicago. Didn't that didn't that didn't that one get uh, canceled this year? No, next year. Oh, uh, next year. I went there. It was pretty cool. It was a nice part of Chicago. Yeah. There really isn't a nice part of Chicago. <laughs> oh no! Everybody was nice. Nobody got robbed or anything. <laughs> Dante's Wildlife. There, there is nice, sir. Oh, okay, I'll give you that nice, sir, but. I'm, I'm See, like, there, there's a nice part of Compton, bro, oh, that yeah. I call nice. But if you're from like Orange County or something, you think you're gonna die still. <laughs> Angelo's my bud, says Bob Keeler. You guys are just hating. Speaking of which, okay, uh, just picture. It. Have you ever watched uh, Griswold's Vacation? Haters gonna hate. And they're in that neighborhood. They're asking for directions and the gunshots, and they go, roll them up. That's St. Louis. That's the epitome of Rockford. Like that's that scene right there. There you go, Bob. There's your, there's your logo there. You're going to come to Aquashella if it's going to happen. If I, was, if I was in Illinois, I would go to Chicago for that. I'm stuck in California where there's barely any good conventions. And the one convention that was going to be here this year got canceled because of everything. Which was the ACA, which That's I was gonna go to. They have parking in. Man, I wanted to go to Rifa Palooza too. Oh, I'm yeah, going there for that. I'm talking about ACA. Do they have parking on site for Aquashella? Yeah. Hey, come oh. to the come to the Rifa Palooza here next year. Yes, P. Yes, Silla. When is Priscilla, it? Your logo, your sticker. Well, that's Back old. the art and the name. That's old. I don't have that one. <laughs> I uh, have that one. For someone that's never been to Aquashella, is that the place where I'm going to like be pissed that I didn't rent a van? Just watch videos. A lot of people make videos of Aquashella. Okay. Speaking of Priscilla and her artwork, Twin City Guppies. Yeah, can we? Yeah, I think if I do go to Aquashella, the Skyline. I'm not going to do any filming. The hmm. Dallas one is the best. To just, just like yeah. I mean, if I go, I'm going to try to enjoy it for what it is and not have to worry about a camera. But you yeah. know why the Dallas one is better yeah. than the Chicago one? Hey, Stay I'm going to the Dallas. Because the venue is four times its size. Because I went to a swap at a, a GCCA swap recently, and man, I just wanted to park on it. That's the one reason I don't want to go to Chicago because someone bumps me. I'll, go. I'll take them with me. <laughs> it's not Chicago. JJ Aquariums with the logos of YouTube and Instagram. Why is Bob putting his Mountain Dew down? What's this Mountain Dew hype about? Mountain Dew is the best, man. Mountain Dew is overrated. It's the best thing since sliced bread. The last time I drank Mountain Dew, I wanted to throw up. 
Yeah, I don't like it either. Top, if you're lurking, here's your sticker. According nice. to love Mountain Dew. If but, I uh, put like a syringe hose up to this yeah. thing and just pop it into my arm, I would. I would yeah. make a hat that holds it like this. <laughs> Co is working on their stickers. Slow with bad hands. Well, I'm waiting for my new logo, and it's going to take a while myself. So it's almost done, though, from what I've heard. Papa Shrimp Aquatics. Such good names. I wonder if they still do videos. Yeah, it's Jerry. <clears throat> he, he, he moved and moved and still moving. I don't know what the heck he's doing. Yeah, I gotcha. Let's see. Cat Aquatics. Does anyone know when Redfish Bluefish updates his website? I do not. Probably when he gets new stuff. Okay. Three more stacks left. What should I do with these stickers? Just stick them on my door or do something else fancy with it? Or just collect them like pugs. <laughs> you should do what Blake did. Put them all on a board and then put more stickers over it and cover stickers with a map. <laughs> yeah, I saw that. He stuck, he stuck me in Canada somewhere. <laughs> Levi's Outdoors and Aquatics. That I should give this to my youngest son. His name's Levi. I really like these bench sticks. Pugs. Let's see. Dirty tanking. That would be so cool to make all the Fish Fam stickers into Pogs. <laughs> we should do it. Stick them on my car. <laughs> See, BJ has been thinking about a logo and name for them. We have a distinctive local landmark that I'm thinking of using. Hmm. Cool. I know, um, what's it called? Well, I got Twin City Guppies that used a very big landmark in the Twin Cities. Oh, I need to go to Minnesota. What was that? I need to go to Minnesota. One of my best friends lives in Minnesota. And Priscilla even put the uh, landmark in the design. Put what? Twin City Guppies. The uh, landmark in the design. Oh, yeah. It's the Twin Cities. Yes. The uh, skyline in the uh, guppy tail. Yeah. Which is awesome, by the way. Twin Cities. The nano tank. This is a pretty neat one. Comes with a free maze. Security devices. <laughs> Comes oh, with a free maze. You guys, you guys got to check him out. He's the bomb. Scott Pete, he's uh, the bomb. Okay, I'm putting that in the list of the checkouts. I don't think he makes videos anymore. He opened the fish store. Ah, gotcha. Sunny Creek Aquatics 2. Amy's channel. That's a pretty cool little logo. That's between here and Chicago. Nebraska and Omaha. Ooh. Mm. Des Moines. I was thinking about driving to Chicago, but I don't want to drive through Nebraska. <laughs> uh, I don't know who this is. I have a guess who this is. I think it. I, th I think I know who this is. Is this your JH Aquatics? Yeah. You got. You have. You have it upside down. The other way. Yeah. Well, nope. is there an upside down on this one? No, the green goes. Wait, wait. Green goes on the top. Yeah, that's right. No, stop. Turn it back. <laughs> no, okay. the green's on the right. Yeah. Ah, there it goes. <laughs> There's many ways for the, putting this one. It's a circle. Right. <laughs> oh, darn it. Oh man, I'm... my finger. Should change the layout, Debo. 
What? So you're on the big screen. Okay, I guess I could do that. Oh, God. Driving from here to Chicago, like between here and North Plate, there's nothing. Yeah, there we go. That probably works better. Yep. Oh, well, there's something. Road road there's absolutely nothing. That's my two check pile. And then what? These Inca 50s. Grand uh, Island? What's in Grand Island? <laughs> those Inca 50s. Those Inca 50s look nice. I'm just scared that, you know, I'd buy them and my water would go. This sticker's for Yeah. Cool. I'm thinking of getting a few of them. Bubbles. I need an RO system first. Yeah. Well, you need to get, uh, when you get that RO uh, unit, Anthony, is also get those off to the Apaches. Hey, what do I remineralize? Or should I just use my regular water to remineralize? <laughs> People have lots of plans easier than that. You could use Shrimp King remineralizer and order it from SwissAquatics.com. Got mom. Oh, wait. That's well, aquatics. <laughs> wow. 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 V stag. Oh, Victor. I love Victor. <laughs> Unconventional aquatics. And I have a feeling I might be bummed out on this because I'm not seeing Jesse's uh, old one yet. Dank tanks. Got some dank tanks here. What is that? What is that a picture of? Kind of looks like a glove of some sort. What is that a picture of? Anyone know? Anthony? Oh, it's um, a gecko hand. Ah, okay. Gecko hand. Okay, so it is a hand. Thank tanks. The bottom of the foot. Ah, gotcha. I was thinking is either some kind of foot or is like some core of some sort, but I, 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 I get, we got the answer. Thanks. I think it's a press the gecko. Ah. At first, I was thinking it looked kind of like a tube worm. <laughs> those, those, those worms that come out of the tubes in the ocean? Oh, yeah. Uh, I recognize that one. I recognize this one too. I got another one. Swiss Aquatics. Oh, my stickers in there? Yeah, your stickers in here. Huh. Your old one, the uh, Priscilla with the MK Art, and the Swiss mm -hmm. Aquatics. I'm trying to sell that sticker. You're trying to sell it? No, people are getting it for free. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's why you come out with a big one. True. I got big ones. Yeah. I need to I need to redesign the logo a little bit. I want to put the mother horn in in there, and I want to make the shrimp a little bit bigger. Yeah. Hey, Nathan Fishboy, how's it going? Nathan. Lucky Smuck Fish Cave. Keeler says the gecko foot looks like his bad foot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sad. My slipper talks now. Your slipper tucks. You just need some good uh, shoe glue. That's all you need. Hey, congratulations. You've joined the club. Very <laughs> likely. Down the wormhole. D. Oh, oh my back's cracking. Oh. <laughs> Five, let's look. Let's see, FSA cichlids. Priscilla, Fishman asks, am I going to get a sticker with my calendar? <laughs> yeah, have you not gotten your calendar yet? Check uh, your mailbox. Uh, Fishman, mm -hmm. she says, check your mailbox. Okay. <laughs> Anthony, did you see what I did today? <laughs> the 
a lot more tanks. Nice, P. Tanktastic. Tanks, tanks, tanks. Tanks. I'm going to fill that rack with tank 12 tanks. Thank you for showing that. I can't read this one. I think, it's, I think it says GD cichlids, but I can't really read it. Your tanks look nicer than mine. <laughs> but you know which tanks I got? I got the dinner list. The 2.5. Look at the corner. Ooh, is that all the way around? No, it's just the front. The back is solid. Hmm. It's two pieces. Well, it's three pieces. The back, the sides, and the front, and the bottom. Nice. And it comes with... Geo Aquatics, again. Vinyl backing. And it comes with a lid. Got Guppy Aquatics. But then I don't know. I'm going to look at it later. Definitely a lot of channels to check out to see if they're doing anything. And if they are, subscribe. Man. Man, what? I just realized that when I go back to doing backgrounds, I'm going to be doing them on crappy Aquion tanks again. Ah. Uh, yeah, probably oh, getting yeah. glass in my fingers. You did all uh, your support, didn't you? Huh? You so the ones you got from uh, oh sorry. So the ones from you got from no ones are pretty good then for you. Oh yeah, bro. The, with the smooth edges, oh it was <laughs> nice. I need to find out where I can buy those tanks. You Crazy do, fish lady. You come to California, you go to Santa Ana and get them from no one's uh, aquarium at. Uh, yeah, no one's aquarium. Well, I need to find out what the wholesaler is that distributes those tanks. Yeah, there has to be a way to get them to a pet shop. Yeah, once you once you oh, contact no one, they just give you that information. Although I think I think they're made in uh, California, aren't they? Um, uh, made, yeah. Um, Corona. Main Corona. Let's see who's this. Can't read this one. This is another one I can't read. The only thing I could read is "Love is Love, Squat Up." That's all I could read on that. Can't really read the name of the channel down there. It's kind of squiggly lines. I'm gonna put that in that. I have no clue, and I can't read the file. Let's see, KPA Aquariums. Another channel I've not heard of. The dollar per gallon sell ended already, George? Yes, it Ah. Uh, it only went for a month. Ah. Uh, hope you don't need any more. Aquion is short on glass. Hmm. We are short on glass. <laughs> E-money. Jesse's still here. Jesse I still, Jesse, I still don't have your old one yet. I have one more stack to go through, and ho I'm hoping it's in there. That was funny. <laughs> okay. Got River Life, which is now, I think, Pond Life. See it, love it, live it. True story. Aquan's out of glass. Aquan's out of glass. Seriously? Yeah. How, glass oh, is made of sand. We have a lot of sand. They have a glass shortage because of China. <laughs> China's buying all the glass. Well, don't sell out of the glass. There's a reason why Aquion tanks are so cheap. <laughs> Low light aquatic. Really? Wait a minute. They, are you telling me they ship glass over here from China? Yeah, and they put the tanks together here in the States and call it made in the United States. Oh. Okay. <sighs> so it's technically made in china oh. assembled in the united states the glass is made in china the plastic comes from the u.s the silicone comes from the u.s as well and it's assembled in the united states wow. all parts come really, from china so really there is like nothing left of all glass aquariums inside of aquion no because that's uh, eventually uh, you know people buying out people all glass turned into aquion now mm. If something is that cheap, 
there's a reason why it's that cheap. Mm -hmm. Well, all glass was it was because they cranked them out in in the U.S. They made the glass here, they made the frames here, they put them together here, everything. There's not one single glass manufacturer in the United States that could supply Aquion with enough glass. Damn. Because <laughs> I was in the like I said back in the day, I want to say all glass made their own glass. They they owned a foundry. Yeah. I like that. I wonder what that factory. I wonder what that glass factory is doing right now, though. Hmm. They're still putting it together here and all that stuff. Yeah, just one more well, fish. I won't be buying Aquion anymore then. <laughs> I can't buy any aquarium product then, like even the fancy stuff, like yeah. the AI lights, whatever. All the parts come from China. They're being assembled in the United Can States. Yeah, lights, uh, every, lights are electronic. Anything electronic comes from China. But uh, the fish tanks, no, I'll, I'll buy a, a different company from now on. Drink, kid, chill, water. Are you going to pay more just to get those tanks then? Same goes for marine land. If you're not buying Aquan, you're not buy, buying a dollar per gallon. I'll go look for old dog glass aquariums. <laughs> see, aquarium I have no, nothing against dog glass at all. I wonder if that AA was uh, Aquariums Anonymous, maybe. I don't know. Got Bobcat Reef with a picture of a Bobcat. And unfortunately, I can see the rest that I have in my hand. I do not have Jesse's old one. I'm so sad now. Koi Beta Finned Addicts. I, ha I have a, a few old heavy glass tanks also. I'm not even going to try to say your name because I can't remember how to say it already. <laughs> Triple Tanks. Ah. Was it Posiwi? Oh, so, has the good old things, the old ones. Yeah. Grumpy Mike's fish. Oh, yeah. Did I do that? Good call, Nathan. I don't know if I did. <laughs> yeah, I already did that. That's why I like to buy um, Dennerly tanks because they are made in Germany. Oh. Christian's fish room. What's What tank? Dennerly. Ah, Dennerly. Okay. I wanna find I wanna find an old jewel tank. And finally the last one which is Peplin Creek Aquatics. And that was the entire stack of stickers that I got from uh Jadwin's Jadwin Aquatics. So you cleaned up. <laughs> got a whole bunch of channels I haven't heard of, probably a lot of defunct ones. But I do got a lot of good stickers in here that are still doing videos and a lot of channels to actually go check out and see they still make videos. But uh, let me go. BJ is asking, where do you get that tank that you were just talking about from Germany? At the fish store? <laughs> and this is the stack of stickers I got. Damn. My stack is bigger than yours. But the one on top is the best. That's what they all yours. All yours are all the same. Like, look, these two point five gallon tanks I was just showing you are by Dennerly. Dennerly. The ones I bought. Mm -hmm. Or Shrimp King, whatever you want to call it. Cube. These. Oh, those are good. Are those acrylic? Acrylic. No, that's glass. The glass. glass. It's high quality stuff. And then that's their U US edition. Hmm. Is that glass? Did they that's make a sure like that? It's a 10 gallon tank. Same around the corners. BJ Palmer says uh, he hasn't noticed that brand of Pet Supplies Plus. <laughs> uh, they don't sell that at Pet Supplies Plus. You have to go to your local fish store. Hmm. Like, JB, well, actually, JB, actually, Pet Supplies Plus is a local pet store. JBJ? You have to go to your mom and pop 
LFS. Wait, this brand here, <laughs> JBJ, is the official distributor of Deadlift in the United States. Hello, Double. Oh, um, and then if you want some U.S. good quality tanks, I believe Innovative Marine hmm. is all made in the States. But I'm not sure where they get their glass from either. That's thick glass. Nice double digits. <laughs> I'm going to call my the mom and pop shop in town and see if they order from Wilson's Pet Supply. And if they do, I'm going to find out if Wilson's Pet Supply carries Sephora tanks. If, if your local fish store doesn't carry this brand or JBJ, you can just tell them to get it. They can call JBJ and get an account with them and get their stuff. Everybody <laughs> can. He, um, BJ, did I say he again? <laughs> And you want to know something? I'm a guy and I sit. You want to know why? Because I'm not standing while I take a pee. I want to relax. I love this thing because, look, it does come with the backer. And it comes with a lid with, like, fancy, fancy brackets for it, too. Oh, cool. Like, the brackets are even around it because the corners are around. That's, that's for the glass, right? Yeah, for the lid. Huh. Hey. Rockford, are you a sitter in public? I sit where I can't. I I don't stand. I standing is out. I don't stand. <laughs> Do you pee standing? Nope. I sit on the gut on the toilet and relax. Even oh, even restroom, bro. Yeah. That you need to relax. <laughs> Even in a public restroom at a gas station? Uh, I'm just saying, because even in public, I ain't going to lie, bro. At home, I sit my ass down and I take a piss. I do it in public. I mean, I've been to prison. So. I ain't going to do it in public, bro. I, I don't touch nothing in public restrooms if I don't have to. I use my foot for everything. Public <laughs> restrooms. And I dealt with that, so, you know, hey, what the hell? Dude, when I grew up, I ate dirt. Dirt was different when we grew up. No. It was cleaner. No. <laughs> I don't even sit in public. If, if the toilet is going to come up and bite my ass, then it's going to happen. <laughs> Not going to get the corona from a public toilet seat. Although I do not stand, I do not sit in urinals. <laughs> uh, 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 um, uh, that's the I draw the line there. I think Rockford is the kind of guy that takes dumps in urinals. <laughs> nope. I was gonna say no one sits in urinals unless they're a hole. I did get expelled from high. Uh, I did get expelled from. Uh, I'm sorry, elementary school for doing long johns though, and I accidentally pissed on a dude. <laughs> Ew. I don't sit without one of those paper covers. It says Bob. If I can find, the, oh, there it is. <laughs> oh wait, no, wait, hold on. No, that's BJ that said that. Sorry. Oh, I love rubbing my bare butt on the on the bare seat. <laughs> oh God, you're gross. Bob said something <laughs> else. Bob would sit, but the water's cold. I'll lick it first. <laughs> I'm sure you do. I, I burn it with a flamethrower first. Actually, no. What I do is I put one foot on one side, one foot on the other, and I squat. <laughs> oh, so you're one of those people who actually squat on the toilet seat. And then, well, no, oh, you missed the current now. Forget it. <laughs> I've actually, I've actually seen footprints on uh, toilet seats in public. Really? Yes. People actually go in the restroom and squat on the toilet. <laughs> I thought that I was actually joking on that. I just, I just, I just go my tippy toes and hope not to touch the ring. <laughs> you need a step ladder. <laughs> hey, How I'm do you step do that, P? You're like three feet tall. What the? F I'm five one. 
Exactly. Is there a difference? <laughs> Three feet. Show I'll show you what you need. Let's I'm gonna see. show you three feet tall next time I see you. Oh damn! Someone's getting kicked in the baby maker. Okay, here, here's here's what you need. Reach. Here, hold on. What? Let me share my screen here. Hey, even at three foot, she could come up with a right hook and catch you in your in your jewels. Here you here's, what, here's what you need. Stop dissing me because I'm short. I was growing when I was 16. Oh, <laughs> what the hell is that? It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a woman thingy thingy, so they thingy. can be standing up. That's yeah. weird. That's a camping thing. Is it like suction? No, it's a little yeah. funnel. That's weird. It's like a funnel. Because some, some campgrounds don't let you poop and pee anymore. <laughs> but that's weird. That's camping. Dude, I they'll sit like, around forever. It's a lady, Jay. <laughs> I'm, I'd rather really go behind the boots. <laughs> no, Fishyman, I didn't find your sticker. Nor did I find uh, H.C. Aqua's old sticker either. So I'm oh, Siri says they work. <laughs> Does it work, believe it or not? Do you have to aim? Uh, you could probably do some aiming with that. Well, I imagine you don't want to just let it go on your leg or something. Why? It's nice and warm. Then why use it at all? <laughs> Dude, I just spit on you everywhere. Holy shit. <laughs> You're so gross, P. <laughs> I know. Let's see. BJ says you can pee on a tree with that. You don't get your shoes wet that way. How far can you pee? <laughs> That's the better question. <laughs> to see hey, hey, come on, pee, get one. Have a pee contest. <laughs> <laughs> hey, did you guess ever have a pee contest? Yeah, that's you what Long John. All right, yeah. Wouldn't that be funny to do that with the chick? I didn't. I didn't. I heard no, that's not really like. You know what? Don't say that. I get. They could probably kick your ass. I'm classy. I don't do that kind of stuff. No way, bro. <laughs> I've done more than eight feet. <laughs> okay. Dude, when they when 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 they squeeze, they got some. It's like a freaking fire hose. Mm -hmm. Blows our, it blows blows a, a dude away. So I'm telling you. Yep, they do. It's okay. Picture a guy as a machine gun and and a girl as like the cannons on the USS Iowa. Rockford, what was the print you liked? The two, what do you say? Uh, the one that Dave was showing. The Angel? Scene, the one that looks like a fish name. The biotope. Oh, the biotope. <laughs> that one. Oh, yeah. yeah, that one. Yeah. Bob was trying to make me jealous with his comment on that video, P. Talking about all the originals he has. Well, Bob knows what's up. Like, he's got so many pan originals, too. I need to get more originals. I think the only one I have is uh, Rex. Is Jesse still here? I don't know. I said, oh, Jesse, by the way, if he's here, your package was $24 shipping. <laughs> Bob bounces on these originals before anyone else gets a chance. 
almost fainted 24 times. That is true. I tried, and, and he just, like, did a bundle deal. That's Bob's favorite thing. How about a bundle deal? <laughs> Anthony, we're going to do a pee contest. <laughs> <laughs> so if Anthony wins, does he give does he get an original? Yes. All right, I'm down then. You better start practicing. <laughs> I'm just gonna start holding it now. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, when my friend reads that email message I just sent her, she's gonna think I'm totally drunk. Because <laughs> I just I pretty much explained it kind of, and then I asked her how far can she be. <laughs> Uh, anyways, <laughs> you need to delete this stream, this stream afterwards. Why? I, I, could cut, I could cut this section out. It's a little bit TMI. What? Not TMI. I need to. I need to um, keep my classy image. <laughs> I'll, I'll try to cut it out. Let me see. This is at uh, hour one twenty one minutes. <laughs> oh, thank God I'm videotaping this. <laughs> What classy image? Yeah. I think this P is going to win. <laughs> Miss, I'd rather go pee behind a bush. I'm classy. <laughs> Pun intended or not, Jesse. From Miradol, sing. Anyways. <laughs> Hey, Jesse, how much uh, brine shrimp eggs do you put in the, this uh, majigger? Oh, Anthony, that looks like way too much food. It was. Did you suck it out? No way. They still ate it all. <laughs> no Jeffy way. Jeffy says four of those scoops. I, I had brine shrimp left over. Wow. I just dumped it in my cube tank that I don't have anything in, just salt water with rocks. And yeah. Yeah, that works. <laughs> hey, just say. Hey, you talking about the, you? the rhino gobius? Yeah. Yeah. Did yeah. you see how much branch we picked right now? Did he send you the video, Jesse? Yeah, I noticed. It's okay. I'm wishing I got some of those now. Yeah, they're pretty cool. Yeah. I saw them like, sparring. I said, man, I, now I want two males because they actually, um, I read somewhere that you should have um, more than one male so that they spar like that. Uh, yeah. Um, if not, they kind of get stale. Like you know, they're not so excited. Mm. So what so you're saying? Like you go down to San Diego and grab some more? Yeah. <laughs> hey, Jesse, is... how much brine shrimp eggs? Oh, four of four of what scoops? I don't have. Oh, scoop. oh, did it give you a scoop? No. Nah, did it come in the tin? No. You you gotta you gotta tell them like, oh, did you order online? You didn't call them. Yeah. I got a scoop of mine. You got a scoop. Did you get a lid? I got a lid. You got a lid. See, you got a lid. And well, a scoop. I, I didn't buy the big can, though. I bought the uh, smaller one. The, uh, oh, yeah. The, oh, okay. If you buy the one with the whole pound can, you got to ask for the scoop and the lid. Uh, but you got to call them. You got to like talk to them on the phone. Uh, uh, wait, what? Who? Anthony, I, I might have a scoop somewhere. Through. Um, but it equals about three fourths of a tablespoon, is how much I put. I mean, you know, three put as much as you need, but um, because if you, if you don't have that much fish to feed, then you don't need that. Yeah, much. I think I just yeah. need one of those because I put a. Hold on, it's three fourths of a what? Tablespoon. So maybe try oh, dude, try dude, a quarter dude, of a dude, tablespoon. Teaspoon. No, no, do a teaspoon. I did only a teaspoon, and that was still mm -hmm. too much. Oh, I did like teaspoon. almost a tablespoon. Like before I uh, fed, I got the batch ready for tomorrow and I did two of them. 
So I'm going to have a whole lot of brine shrimp left over tomorrow. BJ wants to know, uh, basically, uh, they've been thinking about setting up a brine shrimp fish tank. Star Colony, has anyone ever done that? Yeah, it's yeah. not that hard. Um, Jess from Maine's Tales Furs and Fins has done it. Mm. Well, more of a grow up in the colony. It's not that exciting. <laughs> I'll see you guys. Are you leaving, Rockford? Uh, yeah, I'm going to jump down. All right. Have a good night. Later. Later. What do you got to feed them so that they'll actually grow out? I don't know. Fido. Hey, fish. George. What's up, people? George, George, George. Hey, George. Oh, Dorky. George, I fed the snake today. What happened? I fed the snake today. Do I have to give her bigger rats now? I mean, she's gone bigger? Yeah. Hmm. What, like double the size? No. <laughs> then no, wait. <laughs> You'll well, see. How do, how do I know yeah. when I have to do a bigger rat? Okay, so she'll get bigger, right? You want to look at the fattest part of her body, and you want to give it a little smaller rat than that. Just a tiny smaller, so you don't go ahead and kill her, you know? But rats can rat. I fed, I fed medium to all my snakes until they hit their adult adulthood. Then I know that they're going to take the rat. But again, you have a chance of them getting bitten. So what I do, I'm sorry. A lot of you should close your ears right now. I'm about to say something not good. I knock the rat in the head. Stunt it. Not, I don't kill it. I stun it. And I grab it, and I feed the snake, and they grab it right away, and that way it's stunted. It won't be able to bite the snake, so that way I won't harm because I feed live, and I prefer live. Live have uh, what is it called? Um, bacteria culture in there, which is beneficial for the snake. It's like uh, it's the best way to do it, you know. The frozen one doesn't have that. That bacteria is dead in there. Mm. Certain things like that, it matters. Yeah, she will let you know when the female gets like, how old is she now? Let's say three months, two, two and a half months old. I say six months, give a little bigger. After a year, you'll see she's long now. And But if you give her like bigger rat too fast, she'll grow uh fat and short that's not what you want you want to grow her long mm. then fatten her up mm. fat and short is obese it's too much once a yeah and the baby is usually not good of that one i usually, said my, but it's my at that one time how are jesse's gobies doing You mean Gobi? How are oh, I mean, mine are mine at home. My home is okay. No, the ones he Anthony, Anthony has, right? Yeah. You're doing Just well. Kind of, they, look, they look good. They like the uh, video, fighting. George. What's that? Did you not send you the video? Did I send you a video? I seen it when he was showing it. I was just asking, how are they doing? Are they doing good or yeah. looking good? No, I'll send George the video right now. Do you, you want to share it on the stream or no? Yeah, they look good. Oh, what happens, George, if, if they're brown? You, want to the share, you can share it, bro. I, I have it on my phone, though. Okay, uh, so it's okay if I share it then? Yeah. Okay. I'm not posting it. Okay. What you see, what happens, bro? What, what, what do you do when the snake gets bit? The snake gets what? Bit, bit by the rat. Oh, nothing. I don't do nothing. But if it's bad, you should take a hydrogen peroxide, clean it up first, and then there's this uh, medicine called iodine. Just put a drop of that on there. Oh, I got iodine because I use that for my cold. Sweet. Don't worry, girl. 
she'll be fine. And then after a couple of shed later, she you won't even know she got bit. I mean, I got snake. You didn't I really just in case. I didn't stunt it, that? and I won't do that again. Was it Anthony? P, your snake didn't get bit, did she? You're just asking just in case. No, yeah, no, she didn't get bit. I'm just asking for the case. She will get bit. What should I do? Hmm. <laughs> bite the rat to teach it not to bite. <laughs> so I, I don't panic. <laughs> I know hey, what to do. What it? Marcella, one thing. If you get bit, don't do anything crazy. Usually they let you go. I know it's going to hurt a lot, but if you pull your hand, trust me, it's going to hurt a lot, like a lot more because the teeth going to rip your skin apart. And the same time you will be hurting her because you'll be taking her teeth, she can get infection. And I don't know if they regrow the teeth. Um, so, so you should be feeding once a week on the dot if you can. I, I, I'm not worried about getting a bit. I have my pain tolerance is pretty good. Hey, Jerry B, how's it going? Bob, how big is that adult mouse as compared to the snake? Is it Do you have a, a long tongue like this, Priscilla? One of the big mm -hmm. ones? No. You do? One of the big ones. She's 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 never like she's never, never like acted like she would bite me. Second, at me like last you, week. This I mean, is a big one. So I grab the rats with this and I mm. I feed it. So my hand is away from my snakes. You yeah. Know? This is a long tongue. Yeah. So. I feed it with tongues. I would never dare feed it with my hand. <laughs> so, yeah. It, no, it, bro, I, I keep the rat in my hand and, like, just yeah. let it, you know, feed from my hand. Good. I'm not saying nothing to you. <laughs> I can't. I just can't. Lucky you. Did you put the rat in your hand and feed it that way? Come on, George. Stop trolling, Anthony. Which one are you? Doesn't remember, or he never watched the video of how I feed my snake. George had so much bad luck this week that bought a no. lottery. Maybe he will win because every time I got good luck, I lose on the lottery. Mm. Mm. Bye, PJ. And I who are leaving. Nothing went my way. I went to Petco. Dollar gallon sale is over. Like, eh, whatever. Yeah. I'm out of here. No, wait. Marie Jewel is leaving, not PJ. I went to five different LFSs to buy stuff. None of them hooked me up. Cyber Monday, they don't give a crap if you want <laughs> stuff or not. Yeah, I was like, yeah, I walked away. I'm not buying nothing. You guys are rude. I can get stuff online cheaper. <laughs> Yeah, I went to the reef. You know the reef, right? Yeah, I know the reef. Yeah, I grabbed one mm -hmm. plant and walked out of there. I picked up the reef. Uh, Where's that one? I I up. Is that the one on uh, State College? La, La Palma State College. Yeah. I've never it's another the fish there. It's another. It's another tons. Tons tropical. No, I've never the reef, had the, the reef is. Uh, is so it's much cleaner than Plum. It's not bigger, no way. Cleaner, cleaner. Cleaner, cleaner. yes, yes. Far cleaner. Yeah. yeah. Cleaner fish. Thank uh, yeah. yes. There's people who take care of that store, yes. But the fish is double the price like everywhere else, man. I won't buy a fish from them. Yeah, they're pricey. Yeah. Double. I can get fish for two fifty. Is selling it for five, six dollars, like more than double. Yeah, all I know is we need better fish stores up here. She had those uh, blue gobies. What do they call them? Stephanie. Uh, yeah, and 
Yeah, the shiny face right here. She wanted like 14 bucks for each or something. I'm like, ah, that's like I can get it for six dollars. Thank you. <laughs> I didn't say anything to her. I'm like, in my head, I said, ah, I can get it for six bucks. Forget it, man. <laughs> and I can mine the ones I get the same thing. They leave, they're all good. They get it from the same place like the other night, Priscilla was saying. They get it from the same place. <clears throat> You know, the, the more I look at this video of the rhinogobius, yeah, I have a feeling it looks like you have three males and one female. What do you think? I am kind of thinking that as well. It's just one of them looks a little lighter than the other two. Mm -hmm. I'm hoping, I was hoping that's another female, but if what you're saying is true, then I don't know. Maybe I am hoping for three males and one female. Hmm. I, I, I kind of think that's what she has. Maybe, maybe so you do that. Uh, yeah, one you can see the you color. Two more females. Sorry, Dave. No worries. I was saying, good, you give that male to George, you go get two more females. Oh, yeah. <laughs> There you, you go. come down to San Diego with us, George, when we go get the other ones? It's not free, okay? <laughs> They're 30 bucks each, I'll pay you 70 bucks, no worries. Or your gas, too, halfway there. Oh, let's, see if, let's see if we can order. Yeah, sorry, George, we're not buying you anything. You have to come. Yeah. <laughs> okay, no problem. See, see we're, we're, we're buying stuff for Jesse because he's not here, so. You're you know, it's, better, it's better that way. No problem, no problem. I won't be fired. We just want you to come, bro. Jesse That's is getting two males. Exactly. You're not gonna be able to. You, you look, guys. You don't know. You don't. You don't know what I went through today. You don't know. What happened? Had, we had a funeral today. I had to. I was a delivery guy delivering the food, and they wanted me to go ahead and stay. I put my mask on. Everybody's looking at me like, "What's going on?" All my family were all unmasked. Everybody, one minute, they were all unmasked. But I have a wife that will rip my head off in parts if I go in there like that. You know, take off my mask or shake their hands and stuff. I don't put alcohol. Man, she, she'll, she'll be like, you're going to kill me. Don't come home. Like that stuff. You know, I don't want to deal with that. So I'm like, I can't even stay with my family. I barely said hi to my mom and my dad and walked out. I can't even go with see my family bro you think i care about going buying fish from san diego i can drive myself there if i really want to <laughs> see let's see how much let's see how much chipping is gonna be life has been upside down man you i know all of us been hurt that way too you know it's not just me like like we didn't even have any thanksgiving like i feel so bad i couldn't spend thanksgiving with grandpa so and we're not going to have any Christmas or anything like that either. So, see, yeah. my family doesn't understand. They don't know that I have a special needs kids that if they get sick, they can finish. And the wife got diabetes, she's taking medication for that stuff. So, they don't care anyway, but they care. They will all you know, take care of themselves. You just have to <sighs> set your own boundaries. <laughs> Is that grandpa is 97 years old. He said he would like to live to 100. So I don't need to give him the Rona. Yeah. yeah my, 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 my brother came over today. He wore a mask. And he said, oh, I better put up mine too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the person that your brother is taller than you. My brother is shorter than me. Mm. That's probably the only thing I absolutely hated about our trip, Devo. What? Wearing a mask that long. <laughs> yeah. Mm. But it was worth it. It was worth it. <laughs> yeah, it was good. There you go. <laughs> Hundred dollar minimum order. 
That's for four oh. of them. For four of them. Um, Forty dollars in shipping. But I thought it. I thought it. Thirty dollars plus ten dollars handling. I thought shipping is free for over hundred. Isn't that what it says? I mean, no, minimum minimum order. You have to order at least one hundred to get shipping. One hundred minimum yeah. orders, man. Yeah. You, you want to hear the percentage shipping options? Oh. Yesterday, Tiki's had amazing this case. He wanted hundred and ten each. Hundred and ten. I said oh. I'll buy. We'll on to them. I go there tomorrow today when they opened up. He already sold them. I was gonna pay twenty dollars cash. He sold them, bro. They were amazing looking discus. Mm. Hey, Jesse, the angels uh, uh, you were saying your friend has. Does he have any fry for sale? No, he already told me he doesn't have any for sale. That's just his personal stock. So they're full grown. Very large adults. He's not he, no, he's not really. I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I don't think so. I'll ask him. I don't think he is. I would think he would. He would have tried. So maybe he just hasn't had success. He just. Paid Priscilla, when, when, when did you need the photo? But he's asking. Like, he's asking when. Do you care? Wow. Priscilla wanted a photo of those um, Altum Angels. Yeah. Yeah. Do you need it like by a certain date? He's nice, asking. Bro. Hello? She must not be there. She must not be there. Okay. Huh? I just need a really good picture. Sorry, I was messaging somebody back. I just need a really, really good picture. Really that's good. All that's the all the hmm. Like not yeah, a blue phone picture, a good picture. <laughs> you gotta take my my camera over there. Okay. <laughs> um. Okay. But I see when I'm I'm there next. Then next time I go over there, I'll bring up I'll bring over my camera. Like yeah. make some magic happen with your new iPhone. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just tell them what. Uh, just next time I go over then. Oh, you know what I just ordered today? Macro lens and a wide angle lens. Hey, is Alex here in the chat? No, he, he just, Alex, you're not right? Because he just texted me something. He asked me a question. About uh, the airport? Yeah, you got that? Yeah, he sent me that too. We can talk about it. I mean, that would be a nice topic. I like that. Tetra Air Whisper 150, the best for its price value besides a Chemco in your air piston pump. Hey, Chemco. Yeah, Look, for cheap, I paid $60. Maybe you can get it for cheaper. Jibo, I'm running, no joke, 15 tanks, about 20 filters on that one, small filters. That's what he was asking, something cheap mm -hmm. and runs about 15 tanks. G Jibo, cheap. It's running fine. I'm just letting you know. I got another one, but it's not going to run 15 tanks, and I paid $55 for that. And that's the runs about four big air pumps only, like the, air, the big ones. Four to five. Mm -hmm. Look, so, I'll show you. I didn't want to get... A Jamco pump and do the whole loop and all that stuff. Yeah. I just didn't want to deal with it. So I did get myself a air whisper. You should tell Alex to come on the chat. Or and come I'm running 12 outlets on it. What the heck? But then I do also have this one. George was talking about. It's not that twelve for. I got that one too. Yeah, mm. that one's not that many. Yeah, not many pumps. No, but but I have like different pumps. I can show you too. Wait, let me show you. Get up there. Yeah, and then you need 12, 12. 12 outlets, double sponge filters on one air whisper, one fifty. 
Yeah, first world problems here. And they're always on sale. Like for the price value? Yeah. Internet's it's not going to take 6200 even it's though a I diaphragm hate pump, right? Even though I hate freaking Tetra, but here. I got this one, check it out. Oh, that's what it looks like. All I know is Anthony's pump that he just got, that is quieter than quiet. You can't hear this. Mm. Yeah, those are good. Five, $55. Like what it's silent. Yeah, it's like super silent. Look, look at the bubbles coming out. No joke, very strong. Mm -hmm. I go over here and I have another. I'm running all this almost like on them too. Uh, mm -hmm. really. What are you going to say, Anthony? I, I almost want to move my brine impact trees to somewhere else. Just because uh, it's increased the noise in there like three times. Mm. Oh, see, I, I can deal with bubble sounds. It's the hum that, that, that annoys me. Yeah, but if I want to stream in there, I want it quieter. Mm. Is it that loud? It's loud to me. You could probably lower the flow of the bubbles in that. Yeah, we lost Priscilla. Now it's just three, uh, four, four uh, logo people. <laughs> hmm. What can you do to uh, just for that? Let me see here. I don't know. I'd probably try lowering the uh, maybe the volume of the air that's going into that maybe. Maybe. If you can. You probably don't need it to be roaring. I turned it all the way up just for shit to giggle. Mm -hmm. How'd that I go? I really giggle. <laughs> it, it, it started coming out of the top hole. And I didn't even have it filled up all the way. Uh. Oh. By the way, Anthony, you made, you made me spend more money this week. I did? Yes. How's that? I'm getting a new car stereo receiver. One that has Android Auto. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's funny. <laughs> it's nice, isn't it? Yes, it can be. Well, like, see, the one I have now is having, starting to have issues here and there, so... Like, when I got the car, I didn't care. Like, I was like, all right, whatever. Yeah. But then when I actually started to use it, I was like, dang, that is cool. Yeah. I wish my wife's van had that, but we should have waited, one like, one year, and then, then we would have had it in her car, her van. Don't you hate that? Yep. That's or what I do. Went... Like, do I want to buy a new car or do I want to wait? Do I want to yeah. buy a new car or do I want to wait? Yeah. Maybe we should have just got the pilot because the pilot that year had it. So I'm like, uh. Hmm. Maybe we should have just went with Toyota. <laughs> you could install your own if you want. Well, the problem is, and it kind of uh, ruins the whole. Um, there's a screen in there that just co it kind of messes up. Because uh, basically, if she turns her right blinker on, the uh, camera pops up on that screen. And if we change out the radio, that 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 feature disappears. Yeah. I hate radios in newer cars. It's like you change them out, you're losing functionality. At least, at least I could. I mean, at least I could play Bluetooth on on our, on our van pretty easily. So. It's not too big of a deal, but that Android Auto with the maps is much, much better than the mapping navigation on her van. Uh, 
rule of thumb if you're buying a car make sure it has carplay or android auto and not not just a navigation system that's built in <laughs> i don't even know what any of those are uh, android auto <laughs> So Android Auto, I, you have to plug in your phone with the USB, but it links, like, you can play, like, whatever music uh, apps you have, like YouTube, uh, Google Play, or um, Spotify. Some Pandora, I think Spotify. Uh, so you can play stuff like that, you know. If you want it to play something on a certain thing, you can tell it to. That way you're not looking at your phone to do it. Just basically makes it interactive. You can send text messages. You can have it read the text messages if you want. But I guess mine does that through my Bluetooth. Mm. I don't I don't well, you can send you could send your stuff via Bluetooth. If you're talking about just songs. But the added feature of like a uh, Android uh, Auto or CarPlay is you can actually have it send a map to this unit as well, rather than relying on the stupid maps on the car navigations that need to be updated every so often. I do that too. I just go like, "Hey Siri, give me directions to this," and then. Yeah. Oh yeah, you, you probably have CarPlay then. Oh. Okay. Uh, oh yeah. It up on your what? screen in the car. I don't. I don't have a screen <clears throat> on my car, but oh yeah, okay. It just pulls up on my phone. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. We're talking about actually on the car receiver. The oh, like the, the car receiver. display thingy. Oh, okay. Yeah. It's a lot easier than looking on the phone. I like seeing the big map. Yeah, I'll probably be another three years till I get a new car. <laughs> Hopefully by then they have the Model Y out. Mm. Well, your Tesla probably has stuff like that, no? It doesn't have maps so. I, I don't have a Tesla. I have a freaking Nissan Leaf. <laughs> ah. <laughs> oh, that's Leaf cool. have that? mm. Yeah, there's no, there's no monitor on that one. I got like the cheapest, cheapest one. Yeah, Alex. Mm. I wonder if you could change that out. <laughs> Well, if I bought the more expensive model, I could have got some display thingy. Mm. But I was like, nah, I don't need that. <laughs> well, if you didn't have Android Auto or CarPlay, you probably were better off without it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, plus it's like the car for that upgraded model was like $4,000 more. Like, that's not worth it. If mm -hmm. I wanted to, I yeah, just you, buy you, some third party stuff. Yeah, you could change out the radio for cheaper than that. Mm hmm. You'll, you'll you'll see you'll see the radio I bought uh, Jesse on your uh, affiliate list. <laughs> hey yeah. Alex, how's it going? Alex, oh, yeah, that's where we're hiding. He was messaging me. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to print some labels here. Yeah. Here, here's the link if you want to come up, Alex, or anyone else that I could trust to come up here. Which now with the verification on StreamYard, that's going to be pretty opening things up. What? How did you get uh, your uh, logo up there, Devo? I have no clue. I think StreamYard's drunk tonight. <laughs> StreamYard's drunk. No, because oh, when, I, when I came in today, when I started the stream, it was like this, where I had the oh, double weird. logo. I had the double logo earlier. Well, you now you know how to put the double logo back. <laughs> <clears throat> I give a I can have logos all over the place. Alex, you out there, bro? You were asking about the air pump. We talked about it a minute ago, me and Priscilla. Just showed it off too. Yeah. 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 Well, I got yeah. few pumps here. One of them is Jibo. I paid like sixty bucks. Uh, that one works. A lot of small pumps, but it's huh? loud. I bought a bigger one like this for 55 bucks from Amazon. That one is quiet, very quiet, and it runs about maybe eight small pumps, mm. small uh, air filters. That's about eight of them. You can 
kill it to the 10, you know, maximum. I think what he needs to, to, I think to run 12. Okay, time to feed. Time to feed. Oh, my babies. And, and. Laters. Nice. Hey, you guys show us. <laughs> no. Oh, no. Yeah. Yeah, sure. I, I always take you guys along when I feed my shirt. Hey, I'm not really feeling good tonight, guys. I really let me just do this real quick. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm fine. Okay, Alex is gonna get the uh, Tetra 150 right now. Ooh, I, I need to get later. another one. If they're 34.99, they are on sale. I need to get another one. Send me a link, Babel. Okay, we'll do. Let me go and get grab it. Tetra 150. Let's see. Oh, 30, $34.96. They're usually twice the price. Should buy two. Is that, is that the one you bought? I mean, the one you were showing? The yeah. Tetra 150? Yeah, and it's running 12 double spawn switches. There we go. Do That's I need to copy. Do I in? <laughs> Good night, Bob. Good night. No, I don't think I need one. I don't I need do. one, but now I want to buy one. <laughs> I have two needles. So I don't need problems. Need any more than that? They're good backup. I just didn't want to run a piston because I didn't want to deal with the whole making my own valve and bleeding it and all that stuff. I just wanted to go to easy, quiet, run, which is why I got the Tetra one. But I'm setting up the rack. The normal yeah, price is this what? Yeah, I have two two meters. Two, two because like I have um, I have like three fish rings. Three fish rings. Mm. Well, see, you don't count. Whatever. Let <laughs> <laughs> me watch that. This one. Oh, and watch. please make sure when you get that banner, you put a lid. On it. Mm. The lid's on it. She's fine. The the female is fine. She's like looks. It, she looks vicious. She's, like she's gonna here. rip up that mail. Oh, oh well. The, the Whisper 150 is 3.5 watts. Does that sound right? You know what? Yeah. You know what to do in order to get her not to beat up the mail? What? Do you have a breeder box? A breeder box? Oh, okay. I can put them in there for, first. No. Take no. her out the tank. For a day. Let him settle in for 24 hours. Oh. Okay. Yeah, because I'm worried. Like, the way she looks, like, whenever I see her, she just looks so aggressive. I mean, man. They like, just she look like is... assholes. That's their na that's just, <laughs> I that's know, I just, like it. <laughs> that's just their natural face. <laughs> just their sitting face. Yeah, their resting face. <laughs> Hey, does the female have any, like, even light blue on its face? Yeah, maybe a little bit. Very little bit? I'm, like, worried, like, is she a male? It, it's yeah. very slight, but I'm, like, I don't know. There's some, there's some color there. Should be a female. I'll you can tell you. from the egg spot. Oh, yeah, that's right. I should have that. Yeah. Yeah, I cut, yeah, I did see kind of an egg spot. What kind of beta is that? Gladiator. Ah. I mean, they're even named Gladiator. You don't think they're an asshole fish? <laughs> take her out. Okay, take her out. <laughs> See, it's so quiet in here when uh, aqua balls is muted. <laughs> Three ounces. Oh, he has crickets. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Crickets. <laughs> yeah. George has three crickets in his fish room. I have crickets too, but I thought it was just mine, but I think I'm actually hearing his more. Yeah, yeah, because if I'm I put them on mute, it's completely fine. I'm con I put them on mute, let me see. Oh, yeah, it is just him. Okay. <laughs> I can, yeah, I, I can hear mine, but it's not as loud as his. I can, sh oh, I can <laughs> show you right now if you want to see. You don't have to keep me on. I just fed everybody. You want? You can look at them eating. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah. Hold on. 
Priscilla BJ says, I love how you hold back when talking about stuff. Tell him, sister. <laughs> There's the rice fish and everybody else. Oh, yeah. Let me oh, yeah. put it on the big screen here. Yeah, I like this big screen better. Yeah, I know. Sometimes they just need to. My grandma always used to tell me, if you don't have anything nice to say, don't say anything. <laughs> so you didn't listen? Or... <laughs> it's four, five types of fish in there. These guys are not eating for some reason. Mm -hmm. They don't know what Brian shop is. I never gave it to who, them before. Who is that? What are those? Oh, those are the new angels. Mm. You got new I angels? Got about, almost like last Monday, about mm. a week ago. Oh, okay. I didn't Monday. See them yeah. They yeah. they have scale, pearl scale with red cap. So they're red. Look, they're coming over. Watch. They're not scared of me no more. I, they used to freak out when I get close like this. Look, look at this guy. It's coming over right now. Are the rabbits hey, still freaking out? I got, the, I got the plants I want. Are they freaking out? Because I move fast. Here's the java fern I wanted. I got one. Ten dollars. What are those blue textures? No, no not really. turquoise rainbows. The blue ones. Oh, yeah. Oh, they're kind of young yet. They're yeah. They were ten dollars each. That's twenty five percent mm. discount. Yeah, I don't want to buy stuff from not in discounted place. George, right now everything can be different. Every fish well, starts I don't care. Them. I don't want to pay for the expensive stuff. You guys can buy them. I can't. I don't care. I'm broke. They're eating branch and you see them, right? And then we got the Philippine blues. And some babies everywhere. Some babies inside. Some babies inside. Yeah, you can see it, right? They're swimming around. I hold a lot, about maybe 25, 20 left. I don't know. I'm not counting. They're big. Getting bigger. Oh, Some you know died. how I went, to, I went to go sleep over my family's house this weekend? When I came home yesterday, a bunch of the rams died. And then, I guess because I wasn't home to take care of them. The rams? Yeah. A fry? It was, yeah. I still have some left, but a lot, a lot passed away. I just oh, suck out a bunch of bodies. Check these guys out going crazy. This is my favorite thing to look at. Rainbow. I remember Shannon's. Yeah, so I'm going to show you. Everybody's eating. This guy's eating. Uh, I just took all of the loop eyes out of there. Uh, yeah, one one second. This tank is no longer here. There was a tank here. You guys remember? What uh, happened? I can see inside my uh, crush. Uh, crush it though. The tank. Uh, I actually no no. Uh, I started losing a couple of finicky fish. I said, you know what? Take it out. It's not a good spot for it. So I took what, what, yeah, it was some leptosoma. I lost like three of them and I took them out. The rest, I put them down there. And then there was uh, this gold, gold, uh, what you call it? You see them? There's two of them right there, Alto Leprologus. And then there's a male right there in, that, in the shell right there. So I put them in this thing, let them grow up. With the angels, okay? <laughs> They'll be fine for a minute. I'll move them later. Cool. This guy's eating right now. He's getting closer to the crickets. Here are the little guys. 
Hey, so that one rainbow fish that I lost, I got two more females today. Exo rides, exo rides, something like that. Exo ride, some I don't know, he's calling them something. Yeah, it's a rainbow fish. It's a type of rainbow fish. Hmm. See the fries oh, growing big. Dead right. What kind of fry is that? That's a basman eye. Oh, you're eating them with the guppies? <laughs> Bro, guppies. Oh, yeah, look. La Lupais. There is Alto Lampro Logis. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hard water. Yeah. They can breed in hard water. They have to be in hard water. So I said, oh, no, well, let's I got tricked. Definitely I thought, the, I thought yeah. the guppies were in the breeding basket thing. But no, they're just in the tank swimming around in the background. Oh, like, the guppies eat the rainbow fry? What? I thought those guppies were in Hold the on. breeding box. <laughs> yeah, no, bro, sure they are, yeah. yeah, I know, I know now yeah. that they're not. But. Oh yeah, because they look like from here, huh? They're together. Yeah. No, they're like, separate. Oh, okay. <laughs> You're brave. <laughs> Yes, see, I'm sorry, I confused you. You can't put guppies with baby rainbows. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you can. You can always do that, George. You got to be a father. Yeah, oh, look at this. This is like Disneyland in here. Everybody's eating brown shrimp. Look. Mm. I need to do another batch of uh, baby grain. Yeah, I, I need to do another batch too because I harvested right now. Hello, so much those guys. Yeah, I talked to the owner. I told him I'm going to bring this one male that I have. Uh, he's going to give me another female. I usually take it back and get the females because I don't want the males. You don't want the males. <laughs> Oh. Hey, I got one of these. Ouch! <laughs> I have a fan in front of it. Put it up like that. Let it go through the radiator, blow the hot air, throw the tanks and everything. Let it be all night. At least the temperature won't drop down, you know? Only bad thing is when I go in and out of the garage. How much are one of those things? That was, hey, if you were to buy it today, right now, before midnight, it's a uh, 40-something dollar, but I doubled price they did. I would have known it was going to go on sale. I would have waited another day. It went down more than half. The same exact one. Stupid. Yeah, My wife got Amazon, and I'm like, I should return it. Yeah, I don't feel like messing around. Uh, yeah, the, oh, yeah, Amazon, yeah, that's too much. Yeah, yeah I'm, I'm going to return something on Amazon uh, this week. It was, um, it was a Switch game. I, I bought it for 40 because I wanted to buy a first fair. At least I had it. Um, then I was going to buy it at Walmart, which is like $10 cheaper at 30 So I was going to return the $40 one on Amazon, but Amazon wants me to drive down to Irvine to return it for free. So I'm like, nope, I'll, I'll, I'll just keep it for $10 more. Than $10 more. Wait. You guys is watching Well Done Tanks. I was. What does he keep? I was. What kind of fish does he keep? What kind of fish yeah. does he keep? Yeah. Uh, rice fish. Uh, some some mouth cichlids. Guppies uh, too, right? Yeah, some guppies. Good night, Chevy. He ordered something from me and I'm trying to hook it up. Nice. And what? Nice oh, you want to add something to it? Yeah. Oh, he'll right. take, he'll he'll take anything. <laughs> I think he has okay. a room. Hey, Jesse. Yo. I separated this 
angels they got bigger bro i'm gonna take some other ones and separate them too they get bigger and they don't bug each other as much mm. when they're crowded they'll be beating each other up and then yeah, I, they'll go faster too cut yeah, the we'll garden go. down and replanted it and so it would do the same thing it will grow a bunch it's time to turn off the light on here Oh man, he ordered one I don't have cut. Do you see this uh, rainbow shiners? That shining, glowing, whatever they are. Priscilla said they don't glow. Look at these guys, man. Yeah, they're shiny. They're pretty. Oh yeah. Why have they colored up? Amazing. Have they like cut? More blue and red. Oh, oh, you froze. Oh. Hey, I don't know if you guys oh. know this, but Dead Fred joined us. Let's try to get closer. I, I said hi. <laughs> no, you didn't. Yes, I did. <laughs> he said hi when I came in. See. Of course, Dave said hi. He said hi when uh, he let me. I'm ahead of bed, guys. I got a knockout. Hi. Okay. Hey, Anthony. What's up? Hit me up uh, if you're uh, if you have any time Before tomorrow. Before you go, Anthony, I gave you and Dave a shout out this morning on Father the stream. So you might have seen a couple of subscribers hit you this morning. Awesome. Thanks, bro. Right on. Yeah, no doubt, no doubt. I got you. we all fish family, so. so. Um, yeah, those uh, the rainbow shiners do look. They look nicer now. They're more colored up. Yeah, mm -hmm. bro, they look like red, red, really red. Yeah, on it. I mean, they do look good. Now. Really shiny, really good. Hold on, let me put the light on the whole entire tank. Hold on a second. I'm jealous. I hope you read those. I'm gonna try it this way. Other way. Yeah, they look really Are good. they like farting or something? Hey, I don't know when they're breeding and when they're not. Yes. I should buy some from him too. Does he have any more for sale? Yeah, nice. yeah, he does. He does? He like, does. They're gorgeous, bro. I'm I'm gonna get some from Redfish Bluefish too, yeah. and hoping he has better quality. I don't know. This one's really good, but I see a lot yeah, of males here. I want. Yeah. I only see like one, two, three females, bro. The rest of them all males. Wow. Wow. They're going crazy, the females. <laughs> Fifty dollars for how many? Did you put that link for the pump? Where did you put it? You didn't I send did. it to me. Yeah, I'll put it. I'll put it back up again. No, oh, oh, hold on. Give me a second here. I have to find it again. I'm gonna do a water change right now over here. Dude, he's right, selling let me get out fish for fifty. That's great. Dude, that is amazing. I should buy more. That's a cart. That's a cart. Add two cart. Yeah. There you go. Wait, don't make it so bad. Huh? What for sale? Oh, I can't copy it from there. Can you send it? Yeah, I'll put in private chat too. <laughs> I'm on my phone. I can't do technology. I'll send it to you. <laughs> going here, here, hold on, hold on. Let me go to Facebook and I'll text it. Message you up. Can you see him from the top? I got you, for sale. Is that is that Davos link? Let me see something. Yes. yes. Okay. <laughs> you have link to right now? I'm just gonna send you the link. How is it only thirty four dollars? Man, they're nice. That's a card. 
Hello, Corpus. Uh, hopefully, you use one of our links, Alex. <laughs> Are these guys reading this? Or what? Is what the. Are these guys reading? Oh, right My now? Gosh. I don't think so. Look at the colors. So? I don't know. Look at the colors. I don't know. I don't know nothing. They only see three feet. They only wiggle into the gravel. Oh, really? Yeah, you should put some yeah, you should put some river rocks. Mm. Or okay. bubbles. I should oh, oh, river rocks. Okay, let me open up the air again. I had it shut off so you guys can see it. Yeah, they look really great. Yeah, I didn't put them back they didn't there. look this they didn't look like that before. They look way better oh, than they before. Way better. Right? They look way better, huh? They do, right? Yeah. Yeah. Right, they didn't yeah. look like this before. <laughs> Yeah, awesome. I wonder because it just got colder, or it just yeah. took a while to color up, or what? Let's probably get it some of the yeah. You're breaking up there, Derek. All right. Alex, oh, Alex, but, uh, Alex. I think he was talking to George when he asked if they were doing I have to read those guys. Do I have seventy dollars to spend? Yes, I do. <laughs> Review order. <laughs> well, Alex wants to know how did you get them to color up? When you see red with blue, they're within twelve hours of spawning. They've been like that the whole time, Alex. They don't even change their colors. They don't like go back doll. I'm like surprised I am. Where are they breeding? When are they breeding? I should just take them back and forth. How long does it take the eggs to come out hatch? I don't know. I don't know. It takes forever. How you feeling, Kevin? Kev. I just got all that <laughs> work, man. Fuck. Oh no, I need like my credit three. card. It's three a.m. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta, I gotta go in your uh, credit card. I gotta go in my house to get the credit card just to buy this. I hear when I'm, I, I, I hear when I'm that. What are you buying? Oh my god! What Tell happened, David? I guess I guess uh, on uh, Jesse's Amazon's asking to uh, verify the uh, credit card. No, it's it's not Amazon. It's um, get deals. I'm buying those those ah, cool okay, shiners okay. that that George is showing us right now. Uh, gotcha. it's, it, they're, they're $50 for 10. That's great price. For how many? Wait, for 10. Oh, uh, cool. Uh, it's in my card. Don't hold you there. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be right back. I'll get right. my credit card. Credit card. And my cricket's talking to somebody else's crickets. Phone call. The internet. <laughs> oh, I'm going to buy some fish. Yeah. So oh, yeah, I'm going to buy them on Chrome. Five bucks. Do you, like your, do you like your clothes? Let me see here. Kick gills. Let me see. Let me see. What are hey, they? Guys, I'm, like, I'm buying fish. I, I, I spent enough on fish. <laughs> I'm not buying fish for a little while. Yeah. <laughs> How about snail? So I can still buy fish. <laughs> I've got enough fish now. Oh, I, can't, I, can't, I don't see shiners. I'm, I'm about to add a sixth fish tank in my room now. Oh, there they are. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> hey, price of five dollars are on sale for five dollars. Only one's available. Six oh, fish right. tanks? That's cute. Okay, never mind. I I, I see the yeah, six. I, that's I cute. That yeah. There. Sorry, Priscilla. I'm not as advanced as you are yet. <laughs> Okay. When I get, when I get my own house and I can devote a whole room, then I'll be happy. Well, shit. Uh -huh. Then I can just devote a whole house. Fuck just one room. <laughs> should I should I order them before Jesse orders them? I don't think you'll win. I already put my zip code in. It's done. Watch. It's no. not gonna be shipped to Hawaii. Whatever. He's my friend. He knows who I am. <laughs> well, you, you, my stuff, the auto entered into that uh, all that information. All I have to do is hit checkout. 
Uh, even, even if your order, done, like mine is done already. Can you can you actually submit another order? I, I didn't check what how many he had. Oh, when I looked, I had one available. Only one. <laughs> it's done. Thanks for ordering. Okay. <laughs> man. Oh man, I'm gonna set up another tank. Oh yeah, they're uh -huh. gone. They're not there anymore. Jesse oh, Baltimore. Yes. So I sent you the bag of moss with five tiny newborn pintos. Yes, they get the, getting a new tank as well. I I'll hope they make it. I hope so too. Hello, Sandy. How's it going? <laughs> Here, Kev. Yep. Oh, I'm Kev, do you now. have do you have those um black quarries already? No, nah, they're coming. Oh, okay. That's, I was like, whoa. That's just oh, a picture. Like chicken, so. They'll be <laughs> here Thursday. Oh, okay. Jesse. <laughs> Yo. Hey, that's the guy, bro. He has a lot more than one. He said he has hundreds. Well, he just... I he talked to him. I hit him up. He probably just doesn't want to post too much at one time. I do that, too. Because you don't want to get overwhelmed. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah, just, yeah. No, you know him. He's your, he's your buddy. Hit him up on Facebook. No, I, I mean, I, that's all I want. I only want those 10. But yeah, I'll, I'll I talk could, to him. I mean, I'm not supposed to say this, but I couldn't pay him on the get girls. I have to pay him credit card. Who, who, who Wait, I just, the used the cre I just used the credit card on get girls. Good night, Rockford. That's what I, that's what I just Rockford. did. I Teddy couldn't do it. Yeah. There's only, you have to have Vevmo, Vevmo, whatever that is. Viv, Vevmo. Venmo. Oh, I, I use my credit Rockford, did you get my email? Rockford, did you get my email? Uh, I forgot what I was doing already. Oh yeah, I'm looking for his name. <laughs> Hey, Jesse. Yo. Would you buy a extended warranty that includes accidental coverage for the Nintendo Switch or no? Oh, no. I would not. Nope. Define <laughs> accidental. Yeah, right. I'm moving to <laughs> China right now to see to That's another thing. Yeah, accidental. To the tank. I mean, I'm saying if. if if it includes my five-year-old toss it across the room and smash it, yes. <laughs> Other than that, no. Well, so you see, throwing it could be an accident. I mean, you could just be, like, swinging your arm with the switch in there, and you just accidentally, like, go, you know? Oh, Fred, you should got you should have gotten that email, too. Come again? Did you get that email? I got an from email you. from this company called Swiss Aquatic. I just wonder how fast it is actually sending out that email. I, I didn't get an email. Was I supposed to be getting an email? Uh, nope. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't get one yet. So it's slow. I got mine at 5 o'clock. No, you should have gotten the email there, Dave, when you ordered the calendars. But oh, yeah, I, I got that email. Yeah, I just wonder how long it takes Pirate Ship to send out a notification. Oh, oh. Pirate Ship. You got yours at 5 o'clock? Yeah. yeah. That was three my time. Yep. Oh. When did you send it? I think I did print your label at 3 o'clock. Oh. <laughs> well, I have a brand new tank going up, so... Priscilla, <laughs> did you ever get an email from me or no? No. Hmm. Somebody the mug being sent? No, I didn't. No. Can you check your... 
fam. Oh, let me check my um. Possibly. What? The... Don't have. I think it'll come out as an aquarium spot if you want to search for that. No, I didn't get anything from your Dave. From your Dave. No worries. Okay. I guess they just sent it to me then. <laughs> yeah, I can't. Oh man. I can't. Do you think an AquaClear 50 on a 20 gallon long will be too much for these uh black Venezuela quarries? No. Okay. Cool. I just need to get a heater for the tank next. The bigger, the better. Yeah. So, all right. You can slow, like if if you have a hang on back filter that has too much flow, you can easily slow it down with adding too much polyfill or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Or use baffles. Does he need to put a um, pre-filter sponge on there, like on the intake? If you want to try, I would. Yeah, I got to remove the yeah, eggs anyway. But yeah, he's going to take them out anyway and put them in a jar and fiddle with them till they hatch. Yeah. In a coffee <laughs> pot. I'm going to put them in a coffee pot. I'm gonna put them in a coffee pot. I have two coffee pots now. You should get another coffee pot. Uh, my grandfather just threw another coffee pot away. And the coffee pot that I found was one that was sitting already... I don't know what he was doing with it, but I just confiscated coffee pots. <laughs> Why not? I was like, I could use this to hatch my fish. So I sterilized the one... And I used it, and it worked. And I'm going to do it with another one. Yep. Coffee pots are very ingenious. I might set one up as a bed of bowl now. No. <laughs> Better than a coffee pot. Yeah. yeah. I'll plant it too. Is it a five gallon coffee pot? I have no idea, but <laughs> I'll plant it and I'll use one of those little mini LED things that I have that my girlfriend got and I'll grow plants with it in the coffee pot. No, I just gotta. I gotta build another stand for this 20 gallon long so I can fit it in my room. <sighs> you gonna build your own? Yeah, that's the cheapest yeah, way to go, cheapest, bro. Right to go, bro. How are you gonna do it? Two by fours only, or what? Uh, two by fours and um, that's probably about it. Yeah, just two by fours. Yep. It seems about the easiest way to do it yeah. and cheapest. I can't wait till I can set this 55 up, man. Jeez. Hey, Jesse, are you still there? Mm -hmm. is, that the, is that the one that was outside? Nah, it's inside. I didn't. I didn't. I took it outside to clean it, but I brought it back inside. Okay, I remember there was a big one outside. Alex. Yeah. What? Alex. Who's that one? Oh, what's up, Alex? Hello, ladies. Hi. <laughs> I'm nice of you to join us. Hello. Yeah. Hey, Jesse, let me, let me ask you a question before I forget. Do Who's you remember... 
<laughs> Do you remember Jian? <laughs> yes, Jian. Yeah. Yeah. So you know how she put those heat mats underneath her bed uh, jars? No, no, I don't. I don't think I saw that. Yeah, I saw that video. There's yeah. a heat mat that's three I inches wide three. by twenty. You think that actually works if you put a thermal controller on it? Hmm. I have no idea about heaters. What, what is like basically to turn it off when it gets too hot? Is that what you're trying to achieve? Because know. I'm putting up eight beta tanks and I don't want to get eight heaters and I don't want to keep my room above 74. Yeah, mm. Mm. yeah sounds like a good word. Yeah, yeah, uh, are you trying to connect them all to a uh, uh, like a temperature control? Is that what you're trying to do, Priscilla? Yeah. And set it to like 80 degrees and then call it good. Are you gonna have all the Are you gonna have all the tanks connected somehow, or? No, I mean it's just a, a heat mat strip that's three inches wide, and it will go over three tanks, one strip. And I will just put the thermal controller in the middle tank, basically. Mm. Mm. Are you talking about like a heating pad or like an actual heater for an aquarium? A heating pad. Oh, okay. Well, as long as the other tanks are stay within the same temperature as the one in the middle, they have a temperature on them. Sure. Well, I would assume the one in the middle gets the warmest because it has the most mat. Okay. There is an inkboard that actually has two temperature controllers. Do what? There's an inkboard that has two temperature controllers. What well, each heat mat needs its own temperature controller. No, I think what it does is just averages out between two different spots. Well, wherever you put the probe. Okay. Let, me pull it. Let me pull it up and show you. I'm talking about if I can find it. Yeah, I wonder what it's like. If you have two, then what is it trying to achieve there? Like, yeah, well, I, I mean, I guess an average might make sense. Yeah, yeah an average out. Because, because it's either out, it's just an on and off switch. You're like, oh, it's too hot. Turn it off. Uh, or too cold, turn it back on, right? Aristotle yeah. says, yes, it works, but use heat tape and put the probe yeah, put the pro on the water or in the water. Heat tape? Yes, heat tape. He says heat. use heat tape. What is mm. heat tape? Heat tape is stuff that you like wrap around your pipes underneath your house in the wintertime so they don't freeze. Yeah, see, I know nothing about this kind of stuff. Yeah. <laughs> well, I, think, I think that's what she used. I think it was heat tape. I think it was called heat tape. Stuff like that doesn't. We don't have those needs. Uh, Just because you've never been cold in your life doesn't mean that we have to suffer. Well, I don't think you can put a link. You're not a mod. Are you a mod? If you're a mod, you can put a link. I don't know. Dave, Dave doesn't hand out hammers. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to find that one. That is one with humidity control. I bought a dehumidifier on uh, Cyber Monday sale on Amazon. Man, I always fuck up and never have money when cool stuff like this happens. There we go. <laughs> one, one of these times I'll have money and be able to buy something cool. You got Corey's. Well, yeah, I'm talking. Well, yeah, actually, yes, yeah, okay. I got Corey's for. Well, I didn't get it on Cyber Monday, but. Yeah. Did you buy it when he did his flash sale thing? Yeah, the twenty percent off. Nice. And Priscilla, here's the link to that one inkboard I was talking about. I couldn't think I'll get that. Is Alex up here. To see. Yeah. Yes, Alex is here. Did do yeah, you here, know bro. how long does it take for the Rainbow Shiner's eggs to hatch, Alex? Seven to nine days. Wow. Okay. Oh, that's let's count. That's good. Let's, let's count from today. Is it the warmer, the faster, or does it matter? Um, I think warmer, faster. Okay. I'll just and then, the water change. And then, like, they're, they basically, they're like, um about half a centimeter 
within eight days. Like within the first week, they grow really quick after hatching. Oh, that's amazing. Yeah, my quarries grew pretty quick after hatching. Yeah, quarry quarries grow super fast. How about in the acidic soil, like that uh, tropical soil? I have them in there. Would they breed in there or no? No, I think the problem is that the parents like eat the babies like crazy. So, like, they'll yeah. if they can get in there. So what I would do is get some marbles or rocks or beads or something that's round and big enough that like you can make a floor you know or or gravel even just so that some of the eggs at least roll into the cracks or pull the parents mm -hmm. yeah i just pull the parents out yeah I put them in another thing. seven to nine days later i'm gonna see if anything hatched there nothing came out i'm gonna take the parents back from that other thing that i just put them in and back to the other one back yeah. and forth yeah same that's the way to do it you can just trade them back and forth, back and forth. Yeah, until we get successful with them. Yeah. Okay. They're, well, yeah. They only spawn once a year normally, impatient. so they they recover. I think they take longer to recover. I got impatient, you say and I added the first the batch of Cory Fry. Yeah. What? I use heat the tape and bulk group? for both my reptiles and betas. You can cut yeah, it to that's... length. In that's captivity, exactly what talking about, you can get them to spawn more, but they only biologically breed once a year. Yeah, Aristotle, that's exactly what Priscilla's trying to do, because I think uh, some, some person on YouTube did that before. So, yeah, that's exactly what it is. I can't find the heat tape. Let's see here. Well, if Dave would make this person uh, a mod for a second, they could post a link for you to it. Is this it? Yeah. Then cool. use a cord from Home Depot and get good thermostat. Okay, let, 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 let me just go over into YouTube and give give them uh, some mod chips so they could share that link. <laughs> I just need to jump onto YouTube and do it because <coughs> not enough to do allow me to add mod chips to people. Hey, there's a fish you can draw, uh, Priscilla. There's a make lot of fish. A make me a logo with the black Cory cat. You're so demanding. <laughs> there you go, stop. We get out of the lake now. It was That's a hard, hard one to draw. You think so? Yeah, because it's so subtle. Like their their blackness isn't like super dark or anything. It's like I don't know. It's got a pattern to it still, like the Aeneas like pattern. Oh, what gotcha. that look blue and red. Oh yeah, that's, that's okay. Yeah, that's exactly what is in the video. There's your uh, heat tape link. Heat tape link. You you want me to come up tomorrow night, Alex? Right or tomorrow morning? What's that, what time are you doing it? Tomorrow night at seven our or no four four or so our time. Copy. Four <laughs> is that cool? Yeah, I'll be out. Whatever. Oh, that's awesome. It's the first time I've ever I'm ever having like other people on the show. <laughs> oh, oh, you're doing a show tomorrow. Yeah, like I mean, I I usually on Tuesdays and Saturdays I usually do my my own live streams, but um I've only had people like on the show like in that are with me in person, not not that's other claim. Like not not stream aired. I'll be so. right back guys. I'll right. get a cup of coffee. I'm gonna have to get a heater for this twenty gallon long for these Cory cats. Yeah. Mm. How do you order this? 
<laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to get another Eheim Jaeger heater. Giggity think, giggity uh, heater. What um, <laughs> what size do you think the oh. yeah, whatever they are? What size heater do you think I should get for this? A fifty or a hundred? I probably get a hundred. I probably get two hundred just to be safe, but that's me. Yeah. On a twenty long. Yeah. Ooh, I have a lot of hydro in this tank. Because I, I think I got like a a two or a three hundred on my thirty gallon. Yeah, I mean, in theory, like, if your room's only 10 degrees cooler than the tank, you can probably even get away with, like, a 50, you know, a 50 to a 100. Um, yeah. But just in case, like, I don't know, it's super cold one night or something. Or, or yeah, if just... they got ick or, and you wanted to up the temperature yeah, I'll probably get 200 watt. I mean, usually when they're on sale, the difference is like 5 to 10 bucks, so it's kind of like not that big of a deal. Yeah, well... But I do like the Pro Series. The Pro Series what? Heaters rather than the normal, like, like Aquion Pro versus Aquion whatever. Pet. Oh, the Aquion yeah. Pros are terrible. I don't think they're that bad. They, like, had so many of those fail at the store, but we do have a lot of temperature fluctuation. And stuff. Which generation of them? The newest ones or the, the older kind? The first one, because they send us some to test. Uh, was that the one with the clear switch at the top? Not sure, but I had two of them run electric current into the water. Oh, man. That's sketchy. Mm -hmm. He would touch the shelf, he could feel it. <laughs> uh -huh. hmm. Wow. I like the Eheim heaters. No, they're nice, yeah. So are Hydor. Oh. Yeah. So it's sold by the foot. You just need to add however many feet you need to add in the cart. But it says on the tree. Is that three foot or three inches? Three foot, probably. They said inches is a is a uh, two little hashes, and feet is one. Yeah, so it's three inches for two seventy nine. And I need about 30 inches. I always mm. lay my heaters to the side. I put it down the back of the glass laying down. Yeah. Or I'll, or I'll cock it at like an angle. <clears throat> Going down the back of the glass. Where did that red go? Yeah. Did he get dead? <laughs> <coughs> Turned into a zombie? <laughs> I well, actually where... went fall asleep for once. <laughs> Lately, I've been falling asleep sitting up at my computer, like sitting cr cross legged and like with a blanket over me. And I just like hunker down and fall asleep sitting there. <laughs> eBay China heaters were good. Two for 17 bucks. The know, description like, says, heat bucks. we good. Yeah, I need, what, 20, 30 inches. Whoa. That's a That's lot of inches, Priscilla. Well, size matters. So demanding. <laughs> I don't think I can handle 30. That's $63 for 30 inches. So they seems, like, seems like a good deal. 
I can buy heaters for that price and an extra power strip. I just didn't want to have 12 little plugs, uh, 12 plugs because of 12 little heaters. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. You could probably splice it all together if you just got an exacto knife. But I don't know how that works. You might need like a resistor in between each component after you did that. Sounds like a headache. <gasps> I'm thinking about actually building a shelf for it that's closed mm. and I can just heat the inside of it. A what? A shelf? Yeah, with doors. Glass oh, nice. Yeah, I like the racks that look just like completely flush. Like it looks like sheet metal or a filing cabinet, and then an aquarium, and then another layer of the like sheet metal looking stuff. And then you like touch it, and it's got like the little magnetic latches or something. Like those look so slick. They're probably expensive too. Yeah, definitely. So here's 10 feet, which is 18 inches at Home Depot, but it's like $75. Dude, on Amazon, a 300 watt Eheim heater is 27 bucks. It's not bad. That's a good deal. That's a good deal. Hey, oh, by the way, Kev, you owe me $8.50. Is that what I, all right, I got. Cash app. Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> PayPal. No, ha haven't you been my friend? Hold yeah, on. <laughs> he, he signed up for PayPal, so he's good with that. So <laughs> the 300 watt is cheaper than a 250 watt. What the heck is up with that? Hey, Alchemate, how's it going? I've noticed that several times. I'll email you my PayPal. Uh. Is Kevin frozen? No. Well, I might be. Yes. I'm on Amazon right now. Yeah, Kevin's frozen. Oh, yeah, that'll do it. <laughs> I'm on <Yeah>. Amazon. <laughs> You're looking for stuff on Amazon. Yeah. Are you using mine or Jesse's link? <laughs> Get some of that sweet Amazon money. <laughs> the whole 15 cents. Is that all you make when somebody buys something? Yeah, it depends what they're buying. It can be bad as 1%. Oh, it's three inches wide. Hmm. Interesting. Three inches wide. Okay. It's like a strip. Yeah. I yeah. thought it would be a square more. That's a strip you can cut. It's three. You have three, four, six, twelve, twenty, twenty-one inches. Okay, let's see if I get the Somebody came and towed my neighbor's car, guys. She doesn't even know her car got towed. Uh, <laughs> that's not nice. I seen it. I called. I called the lady. I left a message. She wouldn't answer. But what, it was a sneaky. Dude, I hate those tow truck drivers. I used to be one, but not a PPI <laughs> truck driver. <laughs> stuff. No, I was AAA helping. PPI is private party impound. Now, somebody called on her. That means uh, this guy next door right here is the one that did it. And he's not a nice neighbor. I will never talk to him again. I, I, have never been, I haven't been talked to him for like a long time. It's not the one that I'm talking to. It's the other one. Is it the drunk? 
It's not. It's the one in the front, bro. He's a jealous dude. Jealous out of his nose. It's rude to do that, you know. But karma will get him back. You know how many cars he has unregistered in the parking lot? Five cars unregistered, all beat up cars. Not having registered, they don't have insurance, they're just driving cars like that. They have one edge every day. They use your car for call on the neighbor to get their car towed. How rude is that, guys? I'm sorry, man. It's just You think I can get away with two bags of Eco Complete and the uh, 20 long? Probably. Mm, yeah. As long as they're not the smallest size. No, it's the big bag. Yeah. I'd put a little bit of gravel down first, but yeah. Just as like a kind of drainage layer underneath the bottom, and then you can kind of cap it in. Yeah. Is this to that red stuff? No, it's black. It's uh basically a bunch of lava rock, really, really small. It grows a lot of nice beneficial bacteria on it. That's the tank I just tore up. Uh, I I had it mixed red and black together. There's red eco complete and black eco complete. I mix them together. In the 20 long. I might do the red with the black quarry cats, though. I mean, uh, I think that would look pretty cool. You don't get rid of that soil, right? Is, or does it go bad? Does it ever go bad? No, you can keep that stuff forever, dude. Can you wash it and reuse it? Yeah, it basically builds the beneficial bacteria up over time from your tank, and whenever you fertilize, whatever fertilizer doesn't get used, it builds up inside of it as well. I mean, you can re-fertilize it if you want to before you put it in the tank, and it'll absorb it. You have to dry it out for it and then But I mean, that's up I'm, to you. I out of it. There's so much snails in there, Kev. Malaysian trumpet holes you now. But I might do the red. I might try the red with the uh, with the black quarries. I think that would look cool, though. I don't know if you got the black quarries. Did you get them today? No, I didn't. Get, I'll get them Thursday. The, it says okay. the expected yeah. arrival expected. date is Thursday. You shipped them Monday, right? Yeah, he shipped them today. Yeah. Priscilla. What? Is, it, is this the video that you're trying to replicate with the heat tape? Sorry, I'm on my computer. Oh, ah, um, sorry. What's her name, Gloria Spadas? Yeah. Okay. Today is Tuesday, by the way. No more Monday for me. It's almost 1 o'clock over here. That is a fun. Dude, it's three in the morning here. Probably four in the morning right now. I don't know. I just got off work like a little bit ago. <laughs> Gotta love night shift. Man, I used to work night shifts. Back when I worked at a grocery store, I used to bell boxes on night line. Big paper cats with the cardboard. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. All right, guys, I got a head up. Alrighty. Later, Jesse. Later. See you later, Jesse. Have a good night. Later. Yeah. later. I have a question for Priscilla. 
What's that? Now, let's say you have a customer came over and said, hey, I have six discs together in a 55 gallon and one of them have some kind of bacteria going with it. And then uh, would you tell them how much water you change first, right? Mm -hmm. And how what kind of filtration he has, right? I would tell him to and bring would, some of his water so I can test it. That's a good thing. And how about if he says that I change my water every day, like at least 15 gallons on that 55 gallon. Is that too much? Would you tell him, oh, that's too clean of a water? Depends on the nitrates. Like oh, so I said, test that's the water. <laughs> <laughs> so there is such thing as a too much clean water for discus fish? You might remove, you maybe are removing too much beneficial bacteria doing so many water changes. But the bacteria is not in the water. Are we going to a, a The bacteria again? is in the water as well. Some of it, it's not in the water though. We all know, like how many people have been saying about it is not in the water, it's not in the water. How, how, is not how in do you water. think the bacteria gets from the filter to the gravel or to the glass? Yeah. Some of it's going to flutter around in the water and find new places to grow. What do you do to lower your nitrates? Who said I check nitrate? I don't check it. It's actually uh, filter is strong. I have big sponge filters on there, and I have an extra filter pump and running circulating. So it's like a lot of water movement. Yeah, I, but I'm not doing yeah, but 15 gallons of water change every day. No, I was doing like 15 every other day. But if yeah, I don't do water lying. change. I see too. Doesn't matter. Every time you change water, you disturb your gravel, you clean the glass, whatever, you remove beneficial bacteria. Mm -hmm. Yeah, none of that happens over here. First of all, I just take water out, water in. I don't and move nothing. If the fish has a bacterial day. infection, you want to treat the whole tank because it might be something that goes on to the other fish too. Or just take that one out. I mean, you can take that one out and treat them separately in a separate tank, but that doesn't mean the other fish are not having that infection as well. I see. And then if you say bacterial infection, it also depends on what type of bacterial infection it is. Looks like a, like a cloudy eye. Freedom with Metro. General I'll cure. Listen in my tank. I'll tell you, I'm never. You can tell me all day long. Put medicine in the tank, and I would not. I'll take the fish out and medicate them in a separate tank. Now I can do that. I mean, you can try salt. I might hope too. Salt is helping. I have been putting salt. But, uh, well, how long are you going to medicate them for? Like a week, two weeks, three weeks? Well, it all depends on why the fish has that cloudy eye. It might be stressed. It might be hot. If you have the water hot, the bacteria is more, right? So you need to cool it down. I went 82 now. I was 86. And he's doing much better because I went down a little. I can't go lo lower than 82. Why not? Well, it's too cold for him. First of all, in the garage gets too cold over here at night. I don't want. I I have a heater just for them in there. I'm never gonna take that one out. But but why can't you go below eighty two? Are they wild fishes? No. My guy told me don't even keep them at eighty four and eighty six. Who fell asleep? Kevin. Yeah. Who's snoring? Is he? You fell asleep. No. You fell asleep. Alex. Alex. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Alex. Can't tell him, please. Was I snoring? Yeah. He's <laughs> good, bro. George is boring, huh? <laughs> I'm magical. Uh, Alrighty. <sighs> I mean. Take the, if you take the fish out, you treat them, you put them back in, you stress them out. Yep. 
I'm probably gonna pass out myself. I'm getting off here before I do it on the stream though. Later guys. Later. Okay, you me you, you would see the whole night. Thing. Okay. <laughs> night. I think Fred, dead Fred fell asleep too. I think so. <laughs> I'm drinking coffee. It's one o'clock in the morning. <laughs> I'm hungry. Well, George, you're, you're, you're just a crazy nut like that. I don't even feel like going to sleep. I feel like staying up all day long, go to DMV tomorrow morning. Mm. I have some business to attend in DMV. What you doing there? Some business of the DMV. Get a, get a driver license. Huh. Oh, that's a good thing. Expire since January. <laughs> yeah, I had the same thing happen and because of uh, the thing. <laughs> yeah. I, uh, I uh, just let it ride. Yeah, same here, but it's been too long, man. It's been almost a year, you know? Yeah. yeah. Same here. And my I drive, license like, plate expired in October. No, not my license plate, my driver license. I'm, I'm, I'm going to wait for a week. I like get pulled over and then be like, oh, I didn't even notice. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. Huh? There you go. Yeah, I thought it was next year. It expires next January. <laughs> <laughs> Play that game. I see. <laughs> okay. And then no, they okay. give you a thing to go to court. Cops going to be like, yeah, you tried that game on the officer. Look what happens well, right to you. Now you can say, right now you can say, oh, I thought the DMV was closed due to everything. Look, if I get pulled in, it all depends on what city it is. If I get pulled over in LA, uh, I got 50 50 chance for sliding off. They're nice officers. But if I get pulled over in Anaheim, Orange County, somewhere, man, I won't even open my mouth. Just waiting for the sign the ticket and get out of there. Yeah, that's common. No, but mine expired in October, and usually you get a month. So, oh. end of this month, I'm. Um, pushing it but i'm gonna wait till i get pulled over because i don't feel like paying 230 dollars right now for my license plate yeah i hope i get I away with it until after christmas <laughs> <laughs> for Sarah, marie, marie got pulled over one time for fixing ticket she mailed the ticket in 25 dollar and they never received it or something happened right so she had a literally warrant for her arrest for 25 bucks. Oh, uh, really? Yeah, insur we know how we know it because the insurance, uh, we actually uh, called in to get insurance and they're like, hey, your license has been suspended. And she's like, what? I went to the DMV. They're like, yeah. you have a ticket, you got to go pay it, blah, 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 blah. She found out at the court that she they had a warrant for arrest. Wow. If she attended at court and paid a ticket off, she would have got arrested anytime she got pulled. Over. Well, if I get pulled over, it just be like, oh, I didn't even know this. And, and then they give me a thing to go do it within a week and whatnot and just show it. Yes, yeah, most likely I'll fix a ticket. Marie bought this today for me. This one has a lot smaller holes. Mm -hmm. Man, somebody's sleeping hard. Alex again. It's a beautiful. You got the control, man. Look at the difference. There we go. So that one, the one is big, and this one is the smaller, so... I should have known that they had this. My wife didn't buy this for me first. Uh, this is way better to make. If Jesse's watching this later, this is way better to make like a breeding box style uh, for like CPD. If you want to breed a couple pair in there, you know, I have big breeding boxes. I can put this in there and then have little rocks underneath or some kind of a pipe holding mm -hmm. it up a little bit. Yeah, it would work. Okay. I'm going to try it again. I bred CPDs before. They were awesome. And oh. they're going for five bucks each. They were two for five before. How much are they now? Five, six dollars each. Yep. Yeah. No, 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 no. 
<laughs> I'll breed them. They're super easy. Yeah. Well, you're probably going to have to show Jesse that another time. Because I don't think he's going to go in three hours into the stream and rewatch. I'll make a video about it. I'll clean up one of those boxes. I'll put it up all the way and then read some and show them to guys. They were not that bad, but they're slow growers. Three months, we got barely any size on them. Yeah. I fed him every day, Brian. Brian shrimp, Brian shrimp. Yeah. What about what about Derek? Did he fall asleep too? <laughs> I think so. But he, he his mic's not muted. Maybe he's not a snorer. Derek. 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 Oh, he's kind of there. <laughs> I think you he's wake up. All right. He's gonna have wake nightmares. Up. <laughs> Take a and put it in the wake up. All right, well, I'm probably going to go ahead and <laughs> now. So, uh, anyways, uh, thanks for everyone coming up. Thanks for uh, watching, and have a great night. Thank you. I'm going to go get a snack. <laughs> good night. Good night. I'm going to myself. So. Good night. Good night.